What's going on, everybody? Hello there, team. Welcome in. It is great to see all of you on YouTube. I sound like an announcer right now. What is going on? What? Wait, I, you know who I sound like? I sound like Keemstar for a second. Let's get right into the news. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Kimar, hello there. Tony, Ethan was here. Seth, what's going on? It's Torch. What's going on, Torch? Welcome into YouTube. Switching you over to the big screen. I appreciate that, Chief. Welcome in, everybody. It is great to see all of you. It is very, very nice to see all of you. Let me fix uh, my YouTube chat as well. Because they do this thing where I only see some of your messages, not all of your messages. I don't know why. If Jorgs isn't here, I'm leaving. Well, Jorgs is coming, but he's not going to be on voice chat, he said. I think he's just going to be watching. But let me put on some nice little jazz music and we'll get into the plans for tonight, team. Perfect. Team, welcome in. Can you see my face? I certainly hope you can. Because the goal is right now you should be able to see me, and I'm hoping that's the case. I don't know if there's a delay, but I'm assuming it's fine. What up there, Demo? First time catching the stream, welcome in. Why are there two upcoming streams? We are going to be streaming to YouTube on like proper YouTube, but we're also going to be doing a YouTube Shorts stream so that if people are on YouTube Shorts, they can see the stream there. And it'll be basically like, the same stream, just different. So don't, if you're here, you're already here. Don't worry about it. Hey, YouTube stream, what's going on? Welcome in. Under us, by the way, how are you? If Jackson shows up, I'm leaving. Jackson will not be here, team. Jackson will not be here. But let me get into the plan for tonight, team. And let me explain while we're live, or excuse me, why we're live on YouTube. The plan for tonight is we're going to be playing Project Zomboid. There's been a lot of people talking about Fallout recently. I mean, that Fallout show just came out. I really liked it. I watched the whole thing the same day and really loved it. If, if I had to give it a rating, I would say solid 8 out of 10. The only reason I wouldn't give it a 10 out of 10 is I thought... The, the only issue I had with the show, the CGI, kind of sucked in certain spots. I don't know. That's just my opinion, personally. But... Outside of that, it was really cool. It got a lot of people inspired to play Fallout. I've been seeing so many people play Fallout games, like Fallout 76 is blowing up. It just had hit all-time player peak. I've been wanting to play Fallout, but I'm a Zomboid person. I love my Zomboids. So, we had the next best thing. There was a viewer in the community called Shark, I believe. I think it was Shark, who suggested, if I pull up my desktop, this cool little collection of mods which are all fallout themed uh and i'm trying to find the link really quick before i swap over it was somewhere here it is take a look at this team a full list of mods that transform project zomboid into fallout and we have added all of these mods. We have added every single one of these mods to our playthrough. So we are going to be turning Product Zomboid into Fallout tonight on this stream. I, I already loaded in. I kind of know what to expect. I gave myself a couple goals. We got a character. We got a playthrough ready to go. And I'm very excited to jump in and explore the wasteland with all of you. I would love to put on uh, the Fallout music. Unfortunately, YouTube will get copyright claimed immediately. So we can't do that. I can't do Fallout music, sadly. I would love to, but YouTube, they're going to be like, is that Big Iron? You can't play that, <laughs> you know? So as much as I want to, we can't, sadly. You can just pretend that the Fallout music is playing. Or I can sing it for you. I can do that. Yeah, there you go. That... Yeah, oh, I got spur. I got spurs. That jingle, jangle, jingle, jingle, jangle. Are there special stats? Kind of really, like, not really. It still uses the normal skill system, but it'll be fine, team. It'll be fine. Really quickly, though, before we get into the stream, if you enjoy, the one thing that would help me out a ton is hitting the like button. And, of course, if you're new, please subscribe. It helps out even more. 
I want to say as well, because I have not done a YouTube stream at all um, in a long time. Thank you very much for everybody on YouTube for your help on reaching 100k subs. That is just an absolutely unreal milestone that I frankly did not think we would hit. And I do want to take a moment to thank you guys for that before we get into the game. I'm, I'm trying to pull something up here too. There we go. Yeah. Hitting hitting over 100k subs was something I, I thought we were not going to do. But you guys were incredible and, and you helped me out a ton with that. So I, I really do appreciate it. We have a cool little surprise in store for you guys coming out in the next week or two or three. I, I don't know when it's going to happen because I'm kind of waiting on something to show up. But... We will be doing more YouTube streams. This is the start. We also have a lot more YouTube videos coming out too. Uh, both Project Zomboid and non-Project Zomboid content. But regardless, I appreciate it. Hello there, Nicole. How's it going? You're awesome. You deserve every sub. Well, I appreciate you guys, genuinely. It does help out a ton. And I see all the little heart emojis popping up in chat as well. That's very kind of you all. I've, I've never really done a YouTube stream. I've done YouTube streams before. But uh, I've never done it in this capacity, so please bear with me if there's any technical issues. I can show you really quickly while we're uh, getting things ready. I already have a playthrough ready to go, and let me actually swap over to game capture so that OBS works properly and doesn't freak out. Um, oh, hello there, Nickel. How are you doing? How do I tag people? I'm actually not sure if you can, Delana, but how are you doing? Okay, that was very loud for me, but thank you. <laughs> thank you very much for the sub. You're my new... F I didn't get a chance to see this, the name of the sub, but you are... Okay, you're no longer my new favorite sub. That, that, you're my new favorite sub. Thank you for that, uh, the mighty. I appreciate that. Was that, uh, very loud for you guys, or was that not loud for you guys? Was that deafening for you, or was that not deafening for you? Because if it was deafening for you... We will change that. <laughs> it was kind of loud. Okay, I will fix that then. That is not a problem. We can fix that immediately. Kind of, I think. Hold on. I, I didn't I did not expect this issue to appear when we were doing this tonight. I apologize. How are you doing, Beaver? I'm doing well, Nathan. It sounded fine. Okay, well if it sounded fine. Let me let me see if I can just quickly make it quieter for you guys, because I d I don't want you guys to uh have, you know, go deaf. There we go. Perfect. Hopefully the issue is resolved now. We'll see. How do we go all in on you surviving on YouTube? Sadly, there's no gambling, but for anybody who is confused on what I mean, we normally stream on Twitch every Monday to Thursday at 9th and p.m. Eastern. And on Twitch, you are able to do something called predictions, and you can literally gamble on the outcome of playthroughs. We do that all the time. So if you want, come over to the Twitch. But it's nice to see you. This is the setup we're going with, team, for all of the uh, mods we're doing. Uh, if I type in Fallout into the uh, search thing, you can kind of see we have one mod as well that turns all of the zombies into feral ghouls instead, which I think is really cute. We added a bunch of armor from the Fallout series. We added a couple of the weapons from the, the Fallout series. We added chems from Fallout. So there's Jet, there's Psycho, there's things like that. You can also form a uh, chems addiction in this game, which is great. I love that they added that as a feature. We also do have lock picking, uh, and this I believe actually uses like the the Fallout methodology with the screwdriver and whatnot. I think there's also a way to do it for hot wiring vehicles and whatnot. So very excited to see how that's gonna look. Pit boy, we do have a pit boy. We actually do indeed have a pit boy, and I'm excited to see how that goes. Um, so yeah, in terms of the world situation, uh, I already have a playthrough created. If we end up dying with our boy, his name is Eric, by the way, uh, we will simply load up one of the backup worlds. Hopefully we don't die, though. I'm hoping Eric lives a long and successful life out there in the wasteland. Hopefully uh, he doesn't get eaten up out there. There is power armor, too. We do have power armor in the game as well, which I'm super excited for. 
What is your Twitch channel? The username is the same as my uh, YouTube, so it's just Big Bad Beaver across everything. Nice to see you on YouTube. Hello there, Doomcake. How are you? Welcome in. I apologize if I'm missing messages, team. It's just chat is moving a little bit fast and my eyes are terrible. I'm actually going to see if... Can I make chat bigger? Like, can I actually make the chat bigger or no? Oh. I don't know if there's a way for me to make chat bigger on YouTube, sadly. What is your favorite faction in the Fallout games? I think the Brotherhood is just the most interesting to me. I definitely did a lot of Brotherhood stuff in Fallout 3. Um, in Fallout New Vegas, I did House and Yes Man. Uh, I, I don't mind the NCR. The, the uh, what is it called? Caesar Legion? Like, they're the only ones that I, like, don't... I don't want them. I don't, I don't want them at all. I don't know. The Legion, I, I don't like. What is the difference between chop, Top Chat and Live Chat on YouTube? Top Chat is, like... I think it filters out spam, but I don't know how that works. Why is there a Rosewood and a vault Tech Rosewood? So, there is... I, actually, I don't know what that is involved, but it does add one new town, which we will be going to on this playthrough. Let's just jump in. Let's get into it, and I will also get the YouTube mobile stream started for those who watch on YouTube Shorts. Pop out chat and then use control scroll wheel to increase text size. Hold on. Oh my god. Wait, you are cooking. Wait a second. That is so smart. You actually just fixed that. That's so much better. Thank you for that. It did kind of make things a little weird on my other monitor, but that's not an issue, I suppose. Whoa. Whoa, never changes. How are you, Skull? Let me uh, get the YouTube short stream going, and we will begin, team. Oh no, are there ads running? I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Who's your favorite Fallout character? Uh, <sighs> God. <laughs> Definitely... On <laughs> you know, it's kind of weird. I do think it's funny. I think Betty's really funny. Um, I, I don't like a lot of the characters from Fallout 3. That's a tough one. That's a tough one. One Man Army, how are you? Blink, I am having a great weekend. I hope you are as well. Welcome in. It is good to see you. It is very, very nice to see you. Let's jump in, team. Let's get ready. Let's sh Let's get this show on the road, as it were, okay? Team, welcome to my world. Oh, I'm in debug mode. Okay, well, let's let's not get the show on the road. I lied to you all. We're going to we're going to put the show back on pause while I turn off debug mode so that people can't say that I'm cheating in video games, okay? Because as you know, pride is everything, and I would never ever ever utilize cheats in any of my vi um, video games ever to gain any sort of unfair advantage. That is wrong. That is very wrong. War does not change. No, war, war never changes. Well, actually, wait, that is the line. War does change. <laughs> okay, back. Now we go again. Another settlement needs your help. Yeah, Preston... What, what, that was him, right? Preston Garvey? Fallout 4 was the only Fallout that I did not really like, to be honest. Fallout 4 was the only one that, like... I could do without, and I think part of the reason I don't like Fallout 4, sadly, is actually because I was playing on Xbox for Fallout 4 rather than PC. I think that's one of the reasons I did not enjoy Fallout 4. I just did not enjoy, it was like low frame rate, it was like scuffed situations, I don't know, it was weird. Hello there, Prod, how are you? Welcome in. It is nice to see you. What up, Fallout New Vegas? I like New Vegas. New Vegas is my favorite for sure. But team, one moment while I explain everything. Welcome in. Firstly, everybody, please say a nice hello to Eric Radford. We love Eric. Okay, he is going to be our hero for tonight. Eric is repairman. Okay, and the thing about Eric is he has a little settlement. He was running out, trying to get some loot. He got caught off guard by some feral ghouls. One thing led to another. Now he's all the way out here in Rosewood. No vehicle, no way back. Just a baseball bat and his lovely Pip-Boy team to keep him company. The great thing, though, about the Pip-Boy is it actually works. And it does have a GPS system. If I 
yank out the GPS component, there you go. You can see I have a little GPS on the side. If I do that, now I have access to my entire map. So we are currently located right here in Rosewood. Um, in terms of where we want to go, though, there's two locations we can head to. First is back over to our settlement over here, which is a small little town uh, just outside of Rosewood on the highway. So I figure get a car, drive over there, and we'll be fine. But then after that, we can take our car and all the gear we gather from our settlement to go to Vault Tech Team. There is a new location over here, and there actually is an explorable vault, which we can go into, and we can loot all of the gear inside, which I'm really excited to, to try out. But for now, we have a lot of work to do. Is that beeping? Stop beeping. Oh no, my GPS. Oh, it turned off. That's right. Okay, because I pulled out... Right, it's it's a it's a beta model uh, Pip Boy team. You can't just like look at the map. You have to like yank out the GPS component for it to work. So yeah, are there death claws? Sadly, no, no death claws. No death claws. Sadly. Um, ooh, Nuka Cola though. Oh my gosh, I'm taking that. Does it actually look like Nuka Cola when I place it though? That's the real question. What up there, Freaky Pinky? How's it going? Does radiation exist? It does. I don't know if we'll run into it though. We do have a mod installed, which technically adds some form of radiation, but I don't know if we're going to run into it because it's a, like a random chance type thing. Um, but anyways, here we are, out here in Rosewood, and already three fa four feral ghouls standing about menacingly. How disgusting. Is the vault that small? No, no, no. We will actually... You'll see, team. You'll see. Don't worry. Nuka-Cola is great for t fatigue. I'm very excited to hear that. That's a crowbar in that young man's back. What is happening there? That is so interesting. We also have little combat tech, so it's kind of like uh, the Fallout games where you can see their health, which is pretty cool. I will take that crowbar, though. That's not a bad find. Do you have a Geiger counter? Unfortunately, this Pip-Boy model doesn't have that installed just yet, but... Uh, oh. Hold on. I actually want to see the feral ghoul... Let me, let me enhance on this man. Can we see your nose, sir? Oh, maybe not. Here. I want to see the nose disappearing. I don't know if you can really make it out, but they all the, the zomboids are now replaced with feral ghouls, so they kind of have the nose missing. He's not cooperating with me. I'm, I'm sorry. How hard would Kentucky be hit by the Great War? Honestly, not that bad. I mean, as you can see, the world isn't terrible. It's just like normal Kentucky, to be completely honest. Just a little bit more grass, but uh, it's fine. What What's in the magazine? No magazines? That's okay. We're going to make our way over to the fire department. Hopefully we get some gear in there and then we'll be fine. Feral ghouls don't have noses. No, none of the ghouls have noses. They, they lose their nose. It falls off, team. This Fallout 2 mod is crazy. I know. It's like a whole new game. Am I? Is it right? Flo, by the way, what's going on? Welcome in. Oh, is there a feral ghoul chasing after me? There sure is. Can we see your missing nose, please? Oh, yeah, we kind of can. Kind of, not really. I'm trying to... J you'll just have to take my word. How many mods are installed for this run? I think we have about like 50 or 60. There's actually a good number of mods installed on this run for, for this whole system to work together. For everything to come together, there's a lot of work that goes into it. Anthony, what's going on? Michael, how's it going, by the way? Ooh, these cars do not look like they're in good shape, but alas, the nuclear bombs probably would make anything not look in a great, great shape. That's okay. Yeah, that's about expected. Why are the tires looking like that, by the way? They look so old and rusty. Aside from your stand of quality life stuff, yeah, like, we have, like, a solid 30, probably, 40. There is a, you'll see, team, there's so much Fallout stuff. And if you check the description, just like Idol is asking right now, you should actually see the link to the collection of mods that was sent by Shark. So if you want to see exactly what's being used in this, I think all of those mods are being used in this run. But the goal right now is just clear out this current area. And that, no... Please. Thank you. No. They do not cooperate sometimes. It's very sad. 
The great thing about the Pip-Boy, though, is it acts like a watch, so you don't actually need to get any other digital watch. It just tells you the time for you. That's one great thing the Beta Pip-Boy does do for you. We love that. Thank you, Beta Pip-Boy. Big fan of that. What is the vault suit uh, slot so I can spawn with one? I think it's... I actually don't remember. I think it's considered like a full suit, like a hazmat suit type thing. Oh my god, we just one-tapped that poor guy. We are pretty effective with the uh, baseball bat team. Well, I say that, and then what are we doing over here? Not getting any finishes. Ugh. There's a mod that adds in the fusion flea? I think we may have that? I think I may have add I definitely added a bunch of additional weapons. I'm going to utilize the fence for this, actually. Just like normal doobies little creatures, the feral ghouls, they're, uh, oh god, not, not I, oh no, oh, just a scratch, just a scratch, <laughs> just a scratch, uh, they're gonna spread their radioactive nonsense and make me turn. I, I'm going, I am anemic, by the way, so I bleed very rapidly. I need to go rip up clothes immediately. Let me just quickly, no need to scream, by the way, thank you. There we go. Alright, we'll just quickly, quickly throw that on. Yep. Good as new. Good as new, team. We're all good. <laughs> oh, the feral ghouls. <laughs> When will they learn that their actions have consequences? Please. Rawr! Oh, my spurs do indeed jingle, jangle, jingle, let me tell you. Infected already? Just a scratch team, okay? That was not intentional, by the way. That was obviously a Fallout glitch. Like, you know, we've all been there with the game just, like, freaks out. It has a little moment. Like, that's clearly what happened there. Are we cleared again in the fire department? Is that really it? There's no other ghouls around the place? Damn. Okay. Quick victory dance, by the way. Oh, yeah. Nice little victory dance. Still a 7% chance, but we don't roll it, Austin, because we... As long as we pretend that our problems don't exist, then the problem doesn't exist. That's the way we work. Do you want to set the world on fire, Beaver? I wouldn't be opposed to it. I mean, that's kind of already happened with the Great War and the nuclear apocalypse, but... If it happens again, so be it. By the way, in my Fallout 3 playthrough, I did blow up Megaton. And I did it just so I could have a penthouse suite. I am very selfish in that regard, but I got a nice little home out of it. So, judge me if you want. That Why is this cop running around with a bread knife? I don't understand what he's doing. That is not police officer issued. Anyways, goodbye ghoul. Ugh. Okay. Maybe I take the vest. I don't know. Maybe that'll be good for my armor. Okay, so when I said it was going to be good for my armor, I meant in the sense that, like, it would be in good condition. But clearly, it is not. So we'll find better armor later on. Love your videos, man. Thank you. I appreciate that, Pierce. Very, very kind of you. Oh. Here, open this up. Okay, well, wait, can I lockpick this? I can lockpick with my crowbar. Wait a second. Yo, thank you very much, Green. I appreciate- Oh, hold, wait, give me a moment. Oh, no. Oh, dear. This, this is gonna take a minute. I wasn't ready for this level of- Okay, this is gonna be tough. <laughs> this is gonna- I'm not, like, this- My- <laughs> We're gonna get there and eventually, team. Don't, don't worry. We're gonna get in there eventually. Oh, okay. All right, well, I have a new strategy in place. That'll work better, yeah. That, that's good lock picking. Yeah, as you can tell, I did not take lock picking skill as my starting stuff. But thank you very much, Green, for the uh, $10. Super thanks, I appreciate that. Just wanted to hop in and tell you... Thank you. Just wanted to hop in and tell you, you are the man, and I'm proud of your channel growth uh, lately. You deserve it, dude. 
and have a good week. Thank you, man. I really appreciate that. Thank you very, very much. That's very kind of you. Sorry, it, the, the lock picking was a little unexpected. Opinion on spoiled milk? Yeah, you should not be drinking that, my brother in Christ. That will get you ill. Ooh, a sledgehammer actually might be valuable to us, though. Wood axe, no thank you. Um, we could take a box of nails. That wouldn't be a bad thing to take. If we could get a hammer, too, we could maybe do some barricades if we have to get a home somewhere. I do hear someone banging very loudly as well. Ooh. Oh, no. Oh, you are terrifying. Oh, you can see his nose. Hold on. We are enhancing. Enhance. Dolby Vision IMAX quality enhance. HDR 6K quality. Look at him. Look at his face, team. Oh. The nose is missing. How gross. Keep up the work, brother. Love the content. Thank you, man. I really appreciate that. Roasting marshmallows? That's actually kind of sick. How are you roasting marshmallows? Become the ghoul? Well, I am injured already to my... Oh. Hello? My sneaking skill is very high. I'm gonna be fine. I'm gonna be fine, team. Don't you worry. Don't you worry, team. Hey, you mast. How are you? Welcome in. Justin, hello there. Ooh, this is like some... This is not jazzy. Like, this is jazzy, but like, it's not proper jazz. No! Oh! That was a devastating hit. Thanks for the key to this building, though. I appreciate that. You need some chems and a new Coca-Cola? We do have a new Coca-Cola. I can, I can drink it. Oh, it gives me the bottle cap! That's so cute! It actually gives me a bottle cap. That's hilarious. Okay, that's that's not how we drink the... Okay, he's pouring it on the ground. I don't know what we're doing there. That's okay, though. <gasps> Medex! Oh, but it's used already. Damn. I think you could, if you have a high enough skill in medicine, though, be able to synthesize new Medex with this mod. I'm not 100% sure, but yeah, I think you could. I'm gonna take... I, I won't take that. I will take the bandage, though. That's cool to know. And you know what? Can I drink the water? I guess I can. That's fine. Here, I'll clean up my rags, too. Automaton commies and bug infestations. I have not played Helldivers 2 in a while. I've heard it's been really good, though. I gotta go back to it at some point soon. Ooh, beta blockers actually would be pretty helpful. I want to go over to the medical center, too, and see if we can get some, uh, gear. Look at that. Caught you during a stream. Welcome in there. How are you doing? Oh, I'm walking into a, a wall. I wasn't paying attention. Okay, you need to stop that. No, madam, please. That behavior, not necessary. Thank you very much. Thanks for the key as well. Appreciate that. This guy's, yeah. The feral ghouls, they're losing IQ. The intelligence has gone way- Oh. All right. The intelligence may have gone down, but their strength has gone up. Are you excited for Build 42? One million percent. I'm very, very excited for Build 42. We do also have a workshop collection of all the mods that I use on a regular basis, if you're curious. If you type exclamation point mods in chat, you will see it pop up. Ever thought about doing RimWorld? I've done only a very... I don't know what that guy was thinking. Anyways, I've done a very minimal amount of RimWorld. Um, if it's something you guys would like, let me know. Is this game controller compatible? Yes, it is. You can play on a controller. I would not f recommend it, but it is feasible. We'll just continue clearing out the locals, and then I'll probably end up sleeping either here or maybe somewhere nearby. I don't know just yet, but... We'll see. Oh, I can actually just immediately remove my bandage like that? That's kind of sick. With the sidebar. I love that, actually. Uh, what product series is this? This is not a series. We're just doing, like, a one-off uh, playthrough. We're just kind of experimenting with Fallout-style mods. Because the, the Fallout show was really good, and it got me inspired. And Shark listed a very cool uh, list of mods that we could play with. Clean up my rags. RimWorld would be so cool. I've done it a little bit. I think I actually posted like a couple shorts about RimWorld, but I've never done any serious content with it. 
I would like to also... Oh, hold on. Let me... They never cooperate. I want to have a conversation with you guys, and they're just interrupting me left, right, and center, going... Bleh, bleh. Like, that's not even what the sound... That does, the ghouls don't even make that sound. Why do you have annotated... Wait, what is this annotated map for? Rosewood? Question mark? No, not March Ridge. Worthless. I don't want to go to March Ridge. I will hold on to my bottle cap. Imagine if you could trade with bottle caps. Is there an actual vault location in game? Yes, there is, Noah. We're going to be going to that vault. Oh, hold on. My GPS needs to be turned on. If I don't have my GPS on, I can't access my map. Is someone coming after me? No, I'm fine. I thought I heard the, the stomps of uh, a devious little ghoul. But we're, we're okay. Anyways, this is the location of the vault. So the plan is right now... We are going to... We're over in Rosewood right now. We got some... Okay, so there is someone coming over. The plan is we're going to go back to the fire department really quick. So I want to grab one final little item. And then we're going to go over to the settlement that we have, which is just up the street from the highway off of Rosewood. Break in there, get some gear that we need. We're going to go to the vault and clear that out and see what's inside. We will see what happens. What did I miss? I was gone. You have not missed too much. We're just over at the fire department. Dominating the dubious little creatures. They have no idea what's going on. Oh, that guy is unaware. That was a four tap. Damn. I wish there was a Vats-like system mod for this game. Because that would actually be really funny. Yes, thank you for reminding me. Team, if you're enjoying the stream, liking helps out so much. You have no idea. And subscribing, too, if you want. If you're new and you're not already, please subscribe. There are no vaults in Indiana. Well, thankfully, we are in Kentucky. I don't know if there's... Okay, Eric, you're concerning me. You don't seem to be very nimble. You don't seem to be very smart, but I don't know. Anyways, Baja Blast Break. Mm. My god, that went crazy. Ugh. Actually, I wonder, can I lockpick garage doors? Oh, I had the key to this building. Never mind. I'm gonna get rid of the spiked baseball bat. I'm gonna just check for better weapons, and we'll see what happens. Air tank? Saw? Actually, a saw would be very useful for us. Long pants. Do I actually not get weapons? Oh, okay. Well, there's an. it's an axe. What the... That is not going to serve us well at all. That's okay. There was Baja Blast in my Walmart today, but they only had zero sugar. I have not had any Baja Blast near me at all. <gasps> Another Vault Survivor! Friend! No! Brother! I, I apologize. I do what I must. Hold on. Where where is it? Salute my brother. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I feel horrible. He does have another vault boy pit boy too. Damn, that's sick. That I did not know you could run into other vault survivors. That's pretty cool. I do like that. Are you live on Twitch? No, we're just live on YouTube tonight. We are just live on YouTube tonight, actually. Uh, we're just live on YouTube tonight, for sure. Oh, I just broke my thing. There we go, I fixed it. Wear his shoes? He does have shoes. He has shoes on, team. Don't you worry. Oh, there we go. There was an, uh, a rat? Hold on, wait, what was in there? Ooh, what is this? Wait a second. Oh my gosh. Okay, that's kind of good for us, I think. We'll take it. There's multiple of these. Do they both have charge or no? No, neither of them have charge, sadly. Okay. I want a bag is what I really want at the end of the day. I kind of want that. We'll see. There was a gas mask. That actually be kind of good. I did I did notice the gas mask, but I didn't think of picking it up, to be honest. 
What? Who am I hearing, by the way? Wait, where did you even come from? Where were you hiding this whole time? I I almost am con like what? Okay, there we go. Yeah, you know what? Wear this. I don't want to breathe the same air as the ghouls are, because clearly something is going on here. Anyways. What? No. I might just sleep here at this point, too. I might just barricade up. Uh, well, I don't even have a hammer. I can't barricade. Damn. That sucks. I got Proudy Zomboid back in, like, 2020, but I got rid of it because it was too difficult. Because of you, I got back into it in 2023. Let's go, man. I'm glad to hear that. It's definitely a hard game, but it's definitely worth it once you get into it. By the way, Instamash? Oh. Uh, okay, I need to fix the zoom levels. That is actually very zoomed in. There we go. Fixed. What up there, guitar dude? How's it going, man? Let me fill up my water bottle too while we're here. Ever tried the susceptible mod? I have tried it. Is YouTube ads something that can't be helped? I don't think I can do anything about the YouTube ads, to be honest, Tim. I think there's always going to be ads. I can look into it for the next one, but I don't know if I can do anything this time. Okay. I'm gonna get ready to sleep. By the way, we're just slightly over-encumbered. Damn. Uh, let's barricade this door with something. Let's just put the table in front of it and we'll be fine. But I don't know. Did you guys- I'm curious- out of everybody in chat right now, did you guys see the Fallout show? Did any of you guys see the Fallout show? You, uh, you did? What did you think of it? Binged on day one? Yeah, I, I played it day one and it was very good. It was very, very good. I loved the show. Are we freaking out? Wait a minute, there's no way we're infected. You're kidding me right now. Are we actually turning into a ghoul? Is that what you're telling me? I be, the 7% chance of me getting ghoulified by the scratch is happening? Why are you agitated? You don't have a trait that affects anything, right? High thirst, anemic, conspicuous, short-sighted. Oh dear. Oh no. We may be turning. We may indeed be turning. I'm not tired enough to sleep yet either. That's... Very interesting that we're just now getting fatigued to a, a level of that away. <laughs> Let's just do some workout, team. Uh, nothing gets the mind more situated to the current problem like sit-ups. It's amazing. It was a 9 out of 10. I loved it. Thank you for the sub, by the way, Joel. I appreciate that. <laughs> yeah, we need Rad X. There it is. I just want to sleep at this point and see if we get queasy, and if we do, I don't know. Maybe our mission to get to the vault will have to be with uh, Eric version 2, because clearly Eric version 1 might not be feeling too good. But that's okay. Okay, this was the warm-up round. Next time we come back at it, full of vigor and strength and perseverance, and we never give up and we never surrender. Sleep... Wake up in the morning, and don't be ill. You're a nervous wreck, which concerns me. I don't know why you're so nervous. Is there something going on in your life that I'm not aware of? Are you scared of grass? Is it because of the foliage? Are you afraid a bug is on your pillow or some shit like that? Like, what's going on? He's, he's freaking out. I don't know if we reset just now, or if we just see how far this goes. We only slept for two hours, by the way. Oh, it's going to be foggy today, too. Okay, no, we are infected. All right, so listen, because you have messed up, Eric, the vault inhabitants that you were going to go rescue will never be saved. You're going to take off the gas mask, you're going to go find the nearest ghoul, and you are going to feed them. You are going to nourish their body, provide them with calories, nutrients, and vitamins that they desperately need. This young man, let him feast. Do the dance of feasting. Yup. No, no, no. Dance of feasting. But this works. That's fine. 
Don't feed the abominations, but it's okay. Team, now he is an abomination. Oh, I hope one day when I become an abomination, that someone will be so kind to feed me the way I fed them. That's okay. Going back to the main menu now, we go back with Eric. What? <laughs> we have backup saves, luckily. Too much Nuka-Cola. There it was. <laughs> oh, no. It's okay, team. We have backups for this exact purpose. If anything were to go wrong, one button and we're back in it. And we love that. It's just a matter of reloading the Lua now. Perfect. Eric commits tomfoolery sometimes. Occasionally. Ever so often. It, it's not, like, super often, but it does happen. It does happen from time to time, team. What up there, Nugget, by the way? How are you doing? The Brotherhood would not be happy with the beaver? What did I do, Michael? What have I done? Oh, well, I f I'm doing a public service, okay? It's not my fault that this is happening, okay? By the way, this TV, this is wasting electricity. I know it's the apocalypse. I know there's other things to worry about, but, like, this is... We can't have this. Think of the Earth. Save the planet, team. Turn off your lights when you're done. Might not be an abomination, but I am the bomb. <laughs> okay. I'm taking that Nuka-Cola right away. Maybe we won't consume it right away, but we'll just head over to the fire station. We'll get all the gear we need, and then we can move a little bit quicker. We'll move a little bit quicker. We'll be fine. Do you stream full-time? No, I have a job team. I, I don't stream full-time. Content creation isn't a thing. I, I would call it a professional hobby, is what I would say. That's how I describe it as. Do I play Ark? I have never played Ark, but I'm not opposed to trying it. It's like the, the survival game with the little dinosaurs. It looks kind of cute. I like dinosaurs. A side hustle, if you will. Uh, I don't really even consider it a side hustle. Mod list, it should be in the description of the full stream. If you're on the YouTube short stream, we are actually doing like a proper full stream if you go to the channel. Don't do this to me again. I don't deserve it, please. I don't deserve what's about to happen. Oh, this is a great opportunity once I clear out these little guys, of course, to show you the plan team. Ark terrifies me. Oh, is, are the dinosaurs scary? Where's Codsworth? Unfortunately, he's all the way over in Boston, team. Codsworth is... Yeah, we're we're in Kentucky team. That's that guy's on this side of the fence? What the hell? Anyways, let me pull out my GPS team. Let me turn it on, and I will show you guys the plan. Now that the GPS is on and we have a clean signal to the satellites above. Oh no, they're coming forth. God damn it. Stay away. Stay away, please. Um, yo, thank you very much, Drake, for the super chat. I appreciate that. 499 super chat. First actual beaver stream that I managed to make it to after ages of watching on YouTube. Thank you for all the content. I appreciate that, man. That's very, very kind of you. I appreciate the super thanks. My god. It's gonna it's gonna Pop up in a minute because it's weird sometimes. You deserve more subs, man. You're a good channel. I pre Team, I really appreciate all the kind words. You guys are incredible. I have fun doing content creation stuff. And uh, the community we built up is incredible. It's all you guys. You're the real heroes, okay? Don't fucking trip on me. If you trip again, I will lose my mind. Don't do it. Can I explain the plan now? Can I explain? Turn it on. Turn on your GPS. It's the beta version of the Pip-Boy, by the way. He's got to yank out the GPS receiver to make it... Make the map work, okay? Kentucky wasn't the, the point of interest for them. Anyways, we are currently here. The plan is... Thank you again for the, the super chat. <laughs> that was very... I don't know if it's loud for you guys, but it's just deafening in my ears. It's just so loud for me. The plan is go in, get the gear... We will go up to our settlement, which we left a long time ago to get gear for. We haven't been there in a while. I sure hope all the people there are still alive. Hopefully nothing bad happened to them. And then once we have the gear we need, we will head on over to the vault, which is all the way over here. And we will be entering the vault and trying to save the people inside of the vault. 
and see if they are okay, okay? Let's see what happens now. I don't need my uh, GPS enabled anymore, but thank you. Yes, you can turn off now. I actually love that GPS mod, by the way. That's such a cool mod. Can you do a death run? We might do it for a video. I will never do it for a YouTube stream or any stream at all. And the reason I say that is because after doing streaming on Twitch and TikTok for like two years straight, basically, at this point, um, I understand what will happen. And what will happen is if I do a death run, the entire chat will just be, where's game audio? Even if I put on chat, like, like in, in the... Thank you very much for the sub. You are my new favorite sub. Even if we put on the screen, like, death run, no game audio, they will... That people will still ask where game audio is. Oh, sir, can you unlock this for me? Can, there we go. Thank you. I appreciate you unlocking that for me. Now you must die. All right. I'm said people. I'm forgetful and I can't read. Butter, you are better. Why is this a short form video? We are streaming to both YouTube shorts and normal YouTube. If you want to watch the full horizontal stream, you are more than welcome to team. But we are also doing it on YouTube shorts for those people who are on their mobile phones and desiring to watch in a vertical format. We love YouTube Shorts. I love YouTube. Anyways, back at it, team. Okay. Let's go see if uh, the gear is here. Ah, uh, yes, the medex is still... I want to go over to the police station, too, and see if there's, like, crazy firearms there that we missed, maybe. And I do want to grab that sledge, too. No Twitch live? We're only live on YouTube tonight. We love YouTube, team. We truly do. There actually is no sledgehammer this time. This is tragic news for those who enjoy sledgehammers, but that's okay. I can live without a sledgehammer. I don't think we'll need a sledgehammer. Unless a sledgehammer for someone else. Maybe it was. There actually is that. Let me check upstairs, too, to see if we get a bag. I would love a bag. That would go crazy. That would go crazy. There's another... We're streaming to YouTube Shorts and Horizontal. If you're already on the Horizontal thing, you're basically already on the... I guess, like, the proper stream, if that makes sense. But it doesn't matter. Um, all these are empty. I don't know if I can charge these at all, or how that works. This is news to me, team. I'm not sure. What is your favorite Fallout game? I would say New Vegas is probably my favorite. I know what you guys are going to say, too. Oh my god, New Vegas fanboy. He probably hated Fallout. I actually really like the Fallout show. I don't, like... I don't pay too much attention to the lore of the Fallout universe. I just, like, really enjoy the games and, like, just causing mayhem and doing dumb stuff. Um, so when I saw a lot of people complaining on Twitter about the Fallout universe, I was like, after see I'm not going to spoil it, but after seeing the ending to the show, I was like, how can you guys not be happy? And then I found out, like, they're, they, like, retconned a couple things in the New Vegas universe, and it's like, I don't know. It was interesting, Tim. I, I love New Vegas, though. It's just the, it's the most unique setting to me. It's got the most fun factions, in my opinion, to, like, fight against N4. Also, I don't know. Fallout 4 is probably... I would rate the games like this that I have played. Fallout New Vegas, Fallout 3, and then Fallout 4. I've only played those three Fallout games. Fallout 4 I rated the lowest because the main quest line, I just... I didn't really care about the storyline as much as the other games. But then in terms of the uh gameplay experience i played on xbox for fallout 4 which i think was a big mistake for me because i just did not like how it felt on xbox and i think if i played it on pc i would have liked it more but playing on xbox yeah that was kind of a throw in my opinion Ooh, the ghouls are ghoulish today dear god oh my god wait a second okay we need to calm it down a little bit flashlight on there needs to be a pip boy sound effect with the little flashlight going on the irony that I'm currently playing New Vegas. New Vegas is fun. You don't care about children? Okay. but Yes, I care about children, team. But in the grand scheme of things, I much prefer gambling to children. Is that so wrong? 
That's why I'm a New Vegas fan and not a Fallout 4 fan. You stream today? I am indeed streaming today. This is live. Just like my father. There it is. Listen, we are here to profit, okay? How do we do that? By getting 10 luck. We just put all of our special points into luck. And then we make hella money on Blackjack. That's how we do it, team. You can't do that in Fallout 4. I'm sorry. Mamma mia, that's a lot of ghouls. A lot of police officer ghouls, too. Don't know what's going on with that. Uh, my character is freaking out, too. And he is exerted. Okay, we'll lose them a little bit here. Have a soda. Let's see if that helps. By the way, thank you so very much, uh, Daddy, for the four ninety nine dollars super chat. That's very, very kind of you. We love you, Bieber. I appreciate that, too. That's very kind of you. I don't know why... That, you know what? Who am I to question the ghouls? Who am I to question them? Favorite Fallout TV show character? I would have to say... Probably Cooper. I, I think I really liked his the most. I think for me, the reason I like Cooper so much is because of the backstory they developed with him before the bombs dropped. I, again, I don't want to spoil the show or anything like that, but... Like, I, I think Cooper to me was just the most interesting. Lucy was great. Maximus was great. Um, I'm trying to think, was there any character I did not like? Oh, I guess, I guess the knight... I guess I forget his name. That's how much I did not like him. I won't... Again, I won't spoil it, but... Brotherhood is the good people. Uh, depends on your perspective. Depends. Are you in the Brotherhood? Then yes, they are the good people. Um, let's see what we got. Ooh, is this a good blue vest? No, let's find out. Let's hope. Uh, it sure isn't. No, it is not. Holy. Okay, take that off. Yo, yeah, the, the ghoul character was the best. I, I think his... Nor Thank you for the 499 super chat again, Daddy. I appreciate that. Um, while we're running over to the police station team, I will take this moment to remind you all, if you're enjoying the stream, you can help me out a lot by hitting the sub button. And if you're really, 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 really enjoying, you can like the stream. And if you really, 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 really enjoy, you can share it. There we go. Thank you. Oh no, are there people? There's more ghouls inside. There's more to the side as well. Inside and the side. Oh. No, thank you. I wonder if I can lockpick the armory door. That would be sick. Say really one more time. What is this? Pulp Fiction? Say really one more time. Say really one more goddamn time. I dare you, motherfucker. <laughs> Anyways, what do we got in here? Any gear? Lighter? That, that'd be useful. Briefcase? Don't really need a briefcase. What we're here for is the armory. That's all we care about. Thank you very much, by the way. Uh, Pickle and Nader for the $5 super chat. I appreciate that. Helps me out a ton. That's very, very kind of you. I really enjoyed the stream, but I have no one to share it with. You can share it with the... Thank you again, Pickle, for the $5 super chat. That's very kind of you. You. <laughs> There's a lot of sound effects playing. Actually, wait, do you have the key? You do have the key. Oh my god, that makes my life so much easier. I don't even have to lockpick. I do want to try lockpicking, though. If I can, just to see. I can't. Okay, well, whatever. We have the key. Lock picking did not go well for us. Vault Dweller's Builder Guide. What? Make the junk jets? That's actually kind of lit. I, I want to try that now. How are you live here, but not on Twitch? We're live on YouTube proper as well. We're live on both platforms. We're just not live on Twitch tonight, team.
That's kind of sick. I want to try that. What do we need to, to craft it? That is the wrong button. This is the right button. Junk. Junk jet ammo. Anything can really be junk jet. That's cool. But in terms of what we need to make it... Nails, metal sheets, screwdriver, screws, wire... Wow, there's a lot of stuff required. Lead pipes? Okay, this is a lot of resources. We'll put this on the back burner, but it's cool. Okay, so we already have the item at, at hand, it seems. Very cool. Alright, the, the problem that we were faced with no longer exists. I love that. That is awesome. Um, we'll just go and grab... Ooh. Plasma is big. We'll take that. Thank you. If we can find junk, we're fine. I really want to try this out. I'm going to get some junk in a minute. Anything can be junk, right? Let me let me see. We'll take tape. Uh, crossword magazine. Is there, like, something else we can try? Tape again. I don't know what the, the limitation of... Oh my gosh. Here, let me see if I can even turn... No, it requires something a little little bit harder, it seems. Okay. Although maybe the book can be used, right? No? No book? Wow. Okay. We'll figure it out, team. We'll figure it out. What was that item? Desert sticker? Oh, okay. I can put a little thing on there. That's kind of cool. It actually could go on... Oh my god, put a little sticker on there. That's adorable! How cute! That is adorable. Are you Canadian? I am not from Canada, team. I am not. Where's your power armor, soldier? It's, it's coming, team, I promise. Once we get a car... In fact, hold on, couldn't I use... Let me just pick that up really quick. I know for a fact I saw cigarettes as an option, so if I find cigarettes, I'll just take those. I'm actually kind of surprised we haven't run into them. Comb can totally be used. Please tell me comb can be... Yes. Yes, okay. There we go. I want to try this out. After I get a vehicle... Oh my gosh! Talk about overgrown. Does this work? Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna take batteries, just for my thing. I... Actually, wait a second. Okay, so we have a car. It... Probably doesn't run, though. Okay, this runs, we just need fuel. So, if we can get fuel... We're up. Let me take that bottle. Oh, hold on. Someone's pulling up. Who? Who's... Oh my god, it's multiple. Hold on. Oh! <laughs> That was a one-tap, basically! <laughs> Holy shit! Wait, that was effective as hell. Wait a second. He is knocked out, bro. He is slumped over. He is gone. <laughs> that was one item. <laughs> that was just one item. Oh my gosh. Hey, the moss car is cool, though. The moss car is cool. If I can get some stuff there, we're, we're good. Let me see, uh... I want to see if I can use, like, shoes. I'm actually surprised by some of the stuff that you can use and you can't use. If I find wallet, we can use that. Uh, also, if we find, like, a locket. Can we use watches? Disposable camera. Empty cans can be used, okay. Wasn't there a... Yes, there was. Yeah, here. I'll just drink that. And I'll also eat the maple syrup because we're a little hungry. That's nutritious right there. We love that. I'm new to Pride Zombo and I'm still trying to figure out how to make it into the long game. Do you have any advice? The biggest advice I can give you is play it slow. If you play it slow or check out the tutorial. Thank you very much for linking that, by the way. Um, the best advice I can give you, play slow. Because if you rush into things, you're going to just get destroyed. If you don't go in with a plan, 
and you just immediately charge into a building, like, you're kind of done for. So, you know, take your time, think it through. Prioritize getting a good weapon as well. You definitely need a good weapon. Oh, thank you for the gasoline. I hope there's a lot of gasoline. We'll find out. Is there a gas canister? Hold on. The ghouls are very upset. The ghouls... They're not pleased. The ghouls are on their way. We need to, we need to hurry it up a little bit. I just want to see if this has a gas canister inside of it. It does not, but it does have shotgun ammo. Oh dear. The ghoulish freaks have approached. They have found their way about. No thank you. Stay away. Love the veteran occupation. I tried it because you suggested it, Beaver. Let's go. I'm glad you like it. Going back from veteran to not having veteran is kind of tough at times. What mods do you think I should play? I mainly only play with quality of life stuff. This is like the most far out playthrough I've done in recent memory, to be honest. Oh, I can make ammo. Okay, I only have one thing of ammo though. We're fine. There was a shotgun at the front door on the police officer. Was there really? I mean... Why use that, though, when we have this? Like, hold on. Dude. Like... <laughs> that is effective. I love it. It's great. It's great. Oh, come on. There we go. Thank you. Let me tie, uh, taking some of this stuff. That doesn't have any ammo. Can I not use jewelry? I can't use watches either. Damn. I wish you could. Can't use that. Thank you very much for the sub there. I appreciate that, Ashley. You are my new favorite subscriber. Ever. Period. Thank you. <laughs> there we go. Here, fill it up a little bit more. I know you have more. We'll just drive over to the uh, gasoline station. On our way, too, we can go check out the medical center and see if there's, like, medical supplies. I don't know why this car is in such good shape for the condition it's in, but the mechanics of this car are actually really nice. We'll drive on over. Oh, don't mind me, guys. Just on my way. Official Rosewood Vault Dweller business. That guy was clearly an armed insurgent. Okay. Do I risk it for the biscuit? Probably not. Okay. Definitely a lot of them. Hmm. They're breaking windows now, too. Probably not the best idea to be doing this, to be completely honest. But at the same time, when have we ever done good ideas? When have we ever been here for good ideas? We're not here for good ideas. We're here to win. We're here to succeed. We're here to get the goods and get out. I'm gonna risk it. I'm gonna risk it for the biscuit. Give me some goodies. Stim pack. <gasps> no, it's empty! It's all empty! Nurse, what's going on? Cat's eye, okay. We're out. That was our time to search. We had it. I'm dipping. Oh, dear lord. Madam. No, thank you. New strategy in place, because we are a tired creature. Eric needs slumber time. We're gonna go. Give me one moment. And we're just gonna... Hip, hop. There we go. Do that. We're just gonna quickly... Uh... Open this up. Hi there, sir. My name's Eric. I'm gonna be your new roommate. We are gonna get along just fine. There we go. Come on. Go to sleep. No, you're next. Wait your turn. Thank you. One at a time. I don't have all day, you know? I'm a busy man. I've only got two legs, am I right? Oh, 
That's not a good sound. That's not great to witness either. Do I have a crowbar? I don't think I do, actually. Now that I think about it, I don't think I have any backup weapon. Oh, no. At least I have Sunset Sarsaparilla. There we go. This feels too easy after a 100% playthrough. Actually, it's not that easy. Like, it's definitely easier than 100% sprinters, but it's not, like, exceedingly easy. Come on. That sounds like a... That sounds like a lot of them. Dear God, what did I just hear? That sounded like so... So the re... The reason it sounded like so many, by the way, is because it actually was, in fact, a lot of them. That's fine. Can we jump the fence? There we go. Lose them that way. We'll just quickly move this way. Mamma mia. Hey, can I get in there? Oh, right. This is the for sale home. No, there's going to be no loot at all in there. That's okay. Little surprise party. Exactly. They're hanging out. Is this Project Fallout? It literally... Oh, you know what, team? I don't mean to scare you all, but after assessing Eric's current state, the endurance is reaching critical levels, the likes of which we have not seen in a while. Let's try taking this. Uh, which actually, we can't, we can't do anything with that. Never mind. I'm going to drink a soda. That'll at least be a nice little treat for... Oh, hold on. So this is going to be a really risky maneuver. I would not recommend that people do this. But for a professional seasoned Project Zomboid veteran such as myself, I'm willing to risk it all for the good of my settlement. So I'm going to go ahead and we're just going to place that like that. And uh, I'm just going to hide. And when we go to leave tomorrow, we're just going to jump out the window and run for our lives. So that's the plan. Let's slumber now. And let's hope nothing bad happens to us. Let's wait. Actually, let's wait a minute. See, that's not good. That's actually the opposite of good. We don't want to see that. That means we're not good. This is an actual stream found in through shorts. It is. Hello there, Keck. Welcome in. Um, I mean, listen, we have options still. I, I wonder, I, I really, you know, this could be considered really, this is probably really stupid. This is probably really stupid. I'm just sending it. Oh, well, they woke me up. Okay, I'm no longer very, whoa, we're, we're super exerted still though. Do you think we'll get bored of banging on that eventually and leave me alone? Do you think it's one Zomboid, or do you think it's multiple Zomboid? Zombo- Zombod? Is there a plural to Zombo- It's just one little guy! Wait a second! We're chillin'! He's my little friend, after I put him to bed? You gotta slumber, buddy. We don't have all day. Watch it how slow that health bar is draining. Every hit is taking more and more- Ooh, I don't love this. What game is this? It is called Product Zomboid, welcome in. It is a fun little pr uh, zombie survival game filled with dubious little creatures known as Zomboids. This little guy right here is the Zomboid. There we go. Okay, now the roommate is nice and quiet. Actually, don't, don't, don't do that. We, we want to put the... Wait, what is happening right now? I'm so confused. Okay. Oh no, oh no, 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 you're trolling, I'm leaving. I don't have time for this today. My time is too valuable to be dealing with you people. I'm going elsewhere for my needs, okay? Is someone out there? No, Our, well, there is someone out there. Did I hurt my leg? No, we're fine, we're okay. We are all good, team. We are all good in the neighborhood. There's a lot of them out here, though. The The amount of ghouls roaming the streets, pretty bad. Not ideal. Concerns are mounting for me. Hmm. 
Yup. I know. You know what? Eat the steak. There we go. Uh, options. Options, options. What options are available to us? Oh, good. We are indeed still carrying the low... Okay, and I can't drop that either, because that's just gonna... That's okay. I always watch your YouTube shorts. Welcome in, man. It's nice to meet you. I'm, I'm, I'm kind of more focusing on not being eaten alive. Uh, I think we're just gonna walk over with our uh, growing conga line of ghouls over to the vehicle and run off. Oh dear. Oh dear. We're just gonna drive off. We're gonna sleep in the car and we're gonna venture off elsewhere. That's, I think our AP right now, probably really low because of our exertion levels. Don't think we can use vats, but our car is nearby. The car is right there. Please work. If the car works, we're saved. If the car works, we're up. The car needs to work, though. That's a number of them guarding the car. Please. Despite my appearance, I promise you, not a delicious meal. I need you to believe, by the way. Holy shit, I've never believed harder. Oh no. I'm up! I've never been so up! I am out of here. I'm gonna go sleep on the road with my nice fancy car and we're on our way over to the settlement. Skirt! We are- we are back and better than ever. Turn on the lights as well, it's a little hard to see with the darkness. There we go, avoid the- the ghouls on the middle of the road. We should be far enough to- well, no, they're still on the road. Eventually we're gonna pull over and sleep really quick. Got a PC just because of this game? Let's go, man, I hope you're enjoying it. I think that's actually the turnoff to my settlement, too. Okay. I'm gonna sleep here and hope this is fine. Oh my gosh, that was... That's fine. That's okay. That's a good sound. The fact we made it here, by the way, with the amount of fuel we had in this car is also, like, damn. Kind of impressive. But I hope... So, this is great. We'll check our map in a moment. Let me drink my Sunset Sarsaparilla, by the way. That'll be nice. Yep. Double sip. Good. We did very good, Kim. Yeah, I put all my special points into luck, by the way. That is incredible. The fact we made it out of that is like... Dear God. Truly. Let me turn on my GPS really quick. Alright. I just want to make sure we're by... The place I need to be. We are actually not. We're, we gotta go a little bit further down. Okay. Not unexpected. We could check those... What is that? A house up there? What is this? We could check that house to see if there's like a melee weapon or something. I would like a new melee weapon before we head over to our settlement. I hope my, my good friends over there are all good. I haven't checked in on my settlement goers in a, quite a while. Let me turn that off now. There we go. Are you only streaming on YouTube right now? Yes, we are live on YouTube Shorts and on actual, like, normal YouTube. So if you want to watch the full stream, you can subscribe to the channel and then find the other stream from there. Maybe there's also fuel up here. Who knows? Adventure awaits, team. Skirt. I actually like this little house. Very isolated little home, but it is a home nonetheless. Hopefully there's no one inside. Ooh, can I lockpick? Ah, uh, if I had the crowbar, I could. I don't have the ability just yet. Why do you need a weapon to go to your settlement? Just in case- I mean, guys, what if I get mugged on the way? What if there's raiders, okay? What if there's, uh, murdering psychopaths along the road? Can I use it as a weapon? No, I can't use the spatula. Damn, I can use the spoon. 
There we go. Sure, use the spoon. Alright, anything in here? No? Alright, this is... not great. What about in these cardboard boxes? Okay, that's alright. Can't wait, were there- oh my gosh, wait, you're right. Yes, open these up, I can eat them. You are so right, Nick. We can do cans for the junk gun. I'm actually gonna take this with us too so we can get more cans along the way. I can eat these too. I'll just eat them all now. Cool. And I wonder if I can even use the bottle. Wait a minute, for whatever reason I can't use- Thank you very much for the sub, I appreciate that. You are my new favorite sub. I appreciate that very much. Thank you everybody for being here, by the way. That's very kind of you all. I appreciate you all hanging out with me tonight. I hope you guys are enjoying. What mods are you running to make it Fallout themed? We have a whole list of mods that were created by one of our viewers named Shark. Um, if you want to check, it should be in the description. This isn't single player, it is single player. We're doing single player right now. Uh, in terms of NPCs and quests, I added something manually, but I don't, I, I but not, no is the answer you're looking for, no. But you can do quests and things like that a different way if you, thank you very much again there Silas for the sub, I appreciate that. You are now my new favorite sub. How does it feel? Why can I not use the empty cans? Does it have to be empty? It has to be actual. Thank you, Will, for the sub. You are my new favorite sub. I hope you're happy. For whatever reason, I can't use the tin cans. Unless I'm losing my mind. Surely you have to be able to... Wow, you can't use the tin cans. That sucks. Okay, well, that's all right. The more we learn, team. I don't know what that sound was, by the way. Yeah, Shark did a great job on this. Thank you very much there, uh, JDH. You are my new favorite sub. On a walk right now, watching on my phone. I'm loving it. Let's go. I'm glad to hear that. Oh, this house seems so much better. <laughs> Thank you very much, Lee. You are my new favorite sub. <laughs> Why are all the doors locked? Why is every house locked? If I knew locking was going to be more important, I would have brought a lockpick with me. Okay. Well, I don't know why there's no food in there. Ooh. These are great, though. Yeah, no melee weapons whatsoever. Maybe there's a baseball bat, though, or something? Eh, vitamins would be good. That's a good find. We could check out the gasoline station. I don't want to go back to Rosewood, although we might have to. I'm running low on fuel. I am running low on fuel. But I want to get to the settlement, too. Decisions, decisions, team. Oh, there's a closet, though. Please, no, it's just rope. My day is ruined. This is tragic. Is there power armor? Yes, there is. There is power armor in this mod. Best Prodigy Zomboid YouTuber? I appreciate the kind words, man. I think that has to go to ambiguous, though. I'm gonna keep it real. I think ambiguous is kind of like the goat of Zomboid. If I think of Zomboid, immediately I think... By the way, we're just going to the settlement. I'm just w keying. We're doing there. But there's a, um... I appreciate the kind words. I'm full sending it down the road. 500 miles an hour. I blessed the rains down in Africa. And this road will be driven upon if I... It's the last thing I do. I'm checking my phone as I drive, too. This is not recommended by most. Some would say this is even illegal. In the apocalypse, there is no laws. Keep that in mind, team. Anyways, just finished uh, modding New Vegas. I have to finish my modded New Vegas run. I have not. Oh, okay. I'm not allowed to check my map. That's fine. The next turn off to the right, I believe, is the turn I need to take. There it is. Oh my god. <laughs> that could have been way worse, but that's okay. Yes, please don't spam, by the way, because you will get timed out. And we have moderators in chat, sadly. So if you spam, you are gone. 
W mods indeed. Yes, we crashed the car. That's okay though, team. It, crashing is fine. Drink my Nuka Cola. Oh, you're drinking it properly. Oh, never mind. Yeah, that is that is just being poured onto the ground. We are not consuming that. Is this the turn I have to take? I just wanted to check my GP. Wait, where's my GPS? Oh no. Oh no, wait. GPS? Oh dear, did I lose my GPS? Uh, I don't know what I would have done to do that. It's equipped, dear God. You uh, thank you for pointing that out, by the way, Eru. Because I would have lost. I would have. I was close to losing my mind. Very scared. Is this the settlement? It is the settlement. Yay! All right. I can't wait to go back home and say hello to my wondrous friends and family. All the, the settlement goers that rely upon me to bring back good loot. They're going to be so happy to see I'm alive. It's been a couple weeks since I've seen them and said hello. We're good. I'm stuck on a roof. Do you have any tips for clearing large hordes? If you're stuck on a roof specifically, the only thing I can think of is like Call of Duty strategy. Oh, there are the settlement holders. Hello there. Oh, no. No. The settlement people. They have been transformed into ghouls. Who could have seen this one coming? Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, God. <laughs> They're all ghouls. <laughs> Why? Why? <laughs> oh my god. Why is he on fire? Oh dear. Oh no. Okay. This is... Wait a minute. This is not great. <laughs> That's... I mean, this works. We'll, we'll let them... You know what? This this works out in our benefit, if we think about it a little bit. We'll just let them... These were all my friends and family at one point, which it, it's so sad to have to say this, but like, I need them to be burnt to a crisp. Because I don't have a melee weapon, I don't have any... Well, I have a pencil. And a spoon. We could try the spoon. Okay, not going amazing on the spoon so far. It is not very effective. Oh my god. Why are all the campfires lit, by the way? <laughs> what is going on there? Okay, let's calm it down a little bit. Let's calm it down. Fleming Friends Friday, this was not anticipated. This was not what I intended for this to happen. We'll just let them burn. This is fine. They're, they're coming in. All the other friends are coming in. Oh, that's Jerry. Oh, Jerry and I were going to play chess a couple nights ago. Maybe even Caravan if we can figure out how exactly that game works. Oh. Uh, well, at least I'll have more food for myself. Look on the bright side at all times, team. That's the important thing. Positivity is key. You know, all things considered, this spoon is actually quite durable. It's just not doing anything. The spoon- Ooh, what a, a sturdy stick! Wait, that could actually be kind of useful for me. I don't know if I can use it as a weapon or not. The spoon is really not putting in the work that we needed to put in, sadly. But that is okay. Oh, all right. Well, you gave it your all, Spoon, and I appreciate that. Can't repair the baseball bat. If I got nails, I could. Or a hammer. Are you going to be starting to stream on YouTube more often? We- the plan is that I want to do- like, I want to do, like, one or two, like, streams on YouTube a month, really. And then 
Uh, I'll, I'm going to be continuing my normal Monday through Thursday on Twitch. If you guys didn't know, I stream on Twitch every Monday through Thursday at 9 p.m. Eastern. The username is Big Bad Beaver, and you're more than welcome to come over on any of those streams. It's just up to you guys, of course. Um, Mondays is Variety Day, so I do whatever I want, but Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday is Zomboids. The stick cannot be used as a weapon. I feel very annoyed by that. What is that? Sturdy stick again? Cool. At least they're all about to fall asleep. Is TikTok banned in the USA? No, it is not. I think they passed the first part of the bill, but it has to go through all sorts of other hoops and things to actually go into law around here. So it's not banned just yet, but it is currently on the path of being banned. The chess game has been burned. I really hope not, because I could still play chess by myself if I wanted. We do have the junk. We do have like two bullets in there, but I don't think it's worth it right now. I'll get rid of these guys and I'll check all the uh, other buildings, see if there's anything of use there. Thought this was I was watching a YouTube short until I realized it's a stream. Welcome in, man. How are you doing? They started doing YouTube short streams. You're able to stream to YouTube Shorts now, which is actually really cool. I like it. Come on, these guys need to go to sleep. They're so close. There we go. It's it's just the last couple people. If only an empty can words. I would love that. The one thing I've learned playing Project Zomboid is that zombies cannot climb. If there ever was really a zombie apocalypse that happened... Definitely just, like, go on, like, an elevated position and just hide there for a minute. Just wait, and you'll be fine. They'll eventually starve. Alright, please tell me there's items in there. <gasps> a ranger veteran duster! What? Damn. Damn, I like it. That is nice. That looks really good. More GPS gear. Is that a helmet? Oh! <gasps> Wait, I can go with the full NCR outfit. No way. Oh, my beard is kind of... My beard is kind of going through it a little bit, but <laughs> that's fine. Here. Oh, a lot of shotgun ammo. Maybe there's other gear, though. Double holster will take. This is great. I'm glad we got in here. I guess we'll take the shotgun for now. Um, I would like to find more Fallout-esque weapons. Like the junk thing that we that we got a moment ago. I can open up the shotgun shells we got too. Wait, weren't there more shells? Did I grab all the shells? I don't even know if I did anymore. Pretty over encumbered too. Uh, I guess I did. There is an M24 sniper too. I don't think I need that. Damn, I look pretty good. All things considered. Let me get rid of the stick. Let me drink the Nuka-Cola. I love that we just poured on the ground. That's drinking. Please fix. Todd, please. <laughs> it's Bethesda's fault all over again. Oh, is there a little guy in there? Ooh, it's barricaded. Hold on. I'm gonna investigate this. Okay, well, my flashlight's out, actually. So, I'll need a new battery. Hmm. I don't know... What that person's up to. I don't know why there's all that groaning. Oh, whoa, 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 madam. Hey, yo, oh, no thank you. What do we have in here? Uh, nothing of value. Okay. Well, oh, metal bar is good. We'll take that as a weapon. That'll be good as our primary for now. I gotta drop off some gear. I might get rid of the plasma, to be honest. I don't know if we're gonna be running into any plasma-style weapons just yet, but we'll see. I never read this dance magazine either. That's kind of sad. I want to head over to the main heart of my settlement, though, because I left some gear there that I think we're going to really like. I think we're going to really like what the what the gear is there, because I remember I was working on a special little pride before I left. The settlement might be good. What map is this? This is called, I believe, the settlement mod. It literally is like a Fallout-esque settlement added in to uh, the map. You can see the full list of mods we're using in 
the description. You forgot the range of breast... P uh, oh, did I really? That is no bueno, but... With what we're going to be doing in a minute, I think we're going to live, team. Because I'll... You'll see. I just got to find it. Leave me alone. Stay away. I think it's up here. I think is the, the point. Medical Center. Wait, there could actually be really good loot in there, too. Oh, yeah. I think it's right past here. If I can climb, we're good. I don't want to have to use my shotgun right away. Let me drop some of this garbage that I don't need. I don't need that. Don't need that. Don't need the book. The key can go in here. Is he, uh, the bandages will hold on to. This is garbage at this point. Let me just get rid of these little guys. I'm going to check my map one more time. If you can, if you just want to follow the, thank you. That took way too, I don't know what she was up to, by the way. That was kind of weird. Please go to bed. I know you want to. You're tired. Just, just slumber. Thank you. Okay. Where's my GPS? Where is it? Equip. We'll turn this on. I want to check where exactly we are. I'm getting- I'm having trouble getting mods to work. Make sure the mods that you're using are compatible with one another. Because some mods might not be compatible with one another. Oh, it's right up here. Okay, I'm just- I'm just a little bit further away. I'm gonna sit on the ground so I can rest up really quick, too. Just so I can rest for a moment, get my endurance back up. There we go. We're good now. Hopefully no one... Is upset at me. Oh, Brenda. I was really hoping if anybody was going to live, it was you, Brenda. I have no moral qualms about putting you out of your misery, though, as a ghoul. Ah, yes. This is the, the main heart of my operations. Oh, dear. I've done a great job of barricading it, though. Hold on. Okay. Oh, my gosh. The door is blocked entirely. There's bear trap set because I'm a psychopath. Can I have a moment to, to place this very heavy object out of my inventory? Thank you so much for the sub, by the way. I appreciate that. We are not going to be able to put the item out of our inventory. Very sad. Very sad. It appears Eric is a man who wants to wait. You don't have to, you don't have to place it with diligence. Yep, we can just drop that on the ground. Thank you. Let's get rid of these little guys now. In fact, if I have to, I will pull out the shotgun. I will pull out... You know what? Actually, can I vault over this? Can I just vault? Is that a possibility or no? No. I've, I, I've truly thought of everything. Damn. I did a great job building the defenses for this place. Actually, actually, yeah. Use the junk jet to start. We'll just take out that. Oh, no. I used all the ammo. Okay. Back to the shotgun, then. That didn't really work out the way I was hoping. We'll do what we have to. We'll do what we have to. This'll be fine. Watching while doing the laundry. Let's go. Hopefully they break down the walls, too. And then I can get in there and grab what I want. Oh, we need to get beta blockers if we can. I don't know if I have any, though. I don't. Oh, no. I've only made the situation worse. God damn it. Please, Vault. Thank you. What are they going to do about this? They're going to do nothing. That's right. That's what I thought. That's what I thought, little buddy. All right. Well, I do my little iconic victory dance. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hmm. Brenda was always sassy. God damn it. Let me just check my phone really quick. Hope you guys are doing well. I'm now on PC. Let's go. W. Are they breaking something? Oh. Wow, they really don't like that little barricade, do they? I don't blame them. You know what? I didn't like it either. I don't blame them. Let's see if maybe there's some gear over here we can collect. Maybe there's some items of value that can help us on our journey. 
What is a beta blocker? It is a pill you can take in this game. Of course, I don't have that. Are all of these going to be locked? Damn me and my great sense of security. Every single room has been locked. Oh, okay. Well, I found the one room that was not locked. Very good. We're doing a Fallout-inspired run right now, actually. That's why it looks like Fallout. How much ammo do I have left, by the way? 30 shells! Wait a minute, hold up. Yeah, let it sing. What am I thinking? Was that a locket I saw a moment ago? Maybe not. I thought I saw a locket. Oh, well, I might have... Might have pulled up a group or two. Level up and Ooh! <laughs> the Fallout level up music. That's pretty nice, actually. God damn it. Reload again. Hurry. Oh no, we only got one off of that? That is not good. Yo, Dark! Thank you very, very much for the super chat. I appreciate that. Do you know the game Last Day Earth Survival? I've never heard of that, actually, but if you think it would be cool to check out, if you're in my Discord server, just drop the game in the suggestions channel. I'd love to take a look at it. Thank you very much for the uh, super chat again. What up there, Renegade? I did not expect that sound effect to be so extra, by the way. My endurance went up, though. That's good. Here, go back to the metal bar. If we can... Yeah, if we can just finish them off using the metal... Oh, d oh dear. Oh, no. Okay. This did not... This wasn't fully thought out. And uh, that's a problem. Don't do it to me. I don't deserve it. Is there an entry point made yet? Did they break the walls down? Have they done something of use for me? I'm actually shocked my weight is not horrendous. I'm gonna drop the plasma for now. I can always go back and get it later. <gasps> they broke it! Yes! Thank you so much for the sub as well. You're my new favorite sub. I'm in there. Yes, sir. Finally. They've done what I needed. Those ghouls have gone out of their way to make my day so much easier. I appreciate it. Team, there's a very important item that we need to get in here that I'm very excited to grab. I had a special little project I was working on. Look at that, baby. Look at that. Oh, it looks good. Put on the helmet first. Give me that. Nice. Oh, seems like they won't let me have a moment of happiness at all. Suit up. Thank you so much again, Dark, for the super chat. Thank you as well, uh, Pid, Pig, Cook, Woodchuck. Uh, you get five mods to use. Which one do you pick? Well, let me get rid of these little guys first, and then I will answer your question. Number one, definitely taking true actions. Number two, more traits. Number three, better flashlights. Number four... Hmm... Probably Vanilla Firearms Expanded. Number five, Britta's Armor... I gotta have that. Let me lose them in the fence. Hold on. I have an idea. I look good though, team. I'm gonna drop all this. Thank you again for the uh, super chat. That's very, very kind of you, Woodchuck. I appreciate that. Are you winning, son? We sure are. Oh dear. I'm doing my best to win, at least. I, there was also something else I left behind in there before I uh, depart. Ah, uh, yes. Actually, wasn't it over here? Yes, there was more. Please go down. Thank you. Oh, no. Oh, no. I grabbed the wrong thing. No! If I have to, I will do what I must to secure the bag. I had a vehicle... Saved up, ready to go. Screw it. Get me out. 
Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm whipping this one, team. I will do as I must. Look at this bad boy. Got it tuned up. It works perfect. It works perfect. Oh, yeah. Oh, it drives just the way I like to. That's the best thing about it. Oh, yeah. The suspension, you can really feel it. Oh. Oh, I love it. I got the... I need to get the gunstock hitting mod. It is really cool. It is a very good mod. There's more of them? You're kidding me. What? How are there still more? Where are they originating from? I don't understand. I didn't have this many people in my settlement originally. This is insane. This is insane. I did not have this many people in my settlement. Into the vehicle, please. Thank you. Don't damage my car. That's rude of you. That's not nice at all. Now you get ran over. This is the punishment you're delivered. Next time, don't do that. That is so rude of you. Don't crawl away. You are not going anywhere, buddy. You chose this path. Can you just... Thank you. Thank you very much. Are we done now? Are there more? Is that it? Other than those guys down there? I think we're good. I want to... No. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Why are you inside of my building? They're so sturdy. They're so endurance. They are so strong. Okay. What I wanted to pick up was this. My anti-material rifle. Take a look at this bad boy. It's invisible because I put the little Pip-Boy like armor on it. We're chilling. Don't mind any issues there, okay? But what I need is 50 MG rounds. Oh, no, I don't. Wait, doesn't this take... What type of ammo does this take? It does take the... Wait, it does need the magazine. No! Wait! Stop! Hold on. Hold on. Hold up. Can I swap, please? Please? That is so much weight, by the way. That is not good. I don't know if there's someone behind me or not. There is. Cool. Don't do that. Don't do that. That's rude. That's not how you make friends. Your charisma level is too low, alright? You're not gonna pass that skill check by doing that. I'm doing 12 damage now? Oh, boy. Alright, what is taking up the weight? We're just gonna drop that. There we go. Oh, I just realized we have no way to get out. Okay. Let's try this again. Can I join in? We're doing single player right now, sadly. I don't think we were going to be able to get uh, anybody else in. Um, but you, you're welcome to try out the mod collection that we're doing. If you would like to. Okay, this is what takes the fusion cells. So this... No. Okay, let me put this away. This can go over here. This is my new friend. Did I give this one? Oh, look at that. Oh! It looks so good. Let me go get my uh, ammo now, too. How do I not have a bag yet? Is the even bigger question, too. I don't know how we don't have a bag ca uh, thing. But I don't know. Do I need a magazine for this? I need a magazine for my rifle? Oh, no. I hope there's magazines at <laughs> Vault Tech, then. Because I don't have any magazines. <laughs> oh, dear. Maybe there's stuff back over here, too. Large bolt, no. Okay. Soda, thank you so much for the super chat. I appreciate that. That's very, very kind of you. Fallout Party Zomboid? Yes, it is a mod collection that Shark found for the community to try out. I am soaked. Yeah, that doesn't surprise me, to be honest. I'm actually drenched. Damn. Empty gas can. We definitely will take that. I guess the best thing to do is maybe just go... Can you go to the ground, please, sir? He does not feel like going to the ground. 
cooperation was never his strong suit. We are really over encumbered. We are doing no damage. I need to drop some items. <laughs> Thank you again, Soda, for the super chat. Thank you as well, uh, Woodchuck, for the $5 super chat again. What is your favorite koala and why is it New Vegas? Oddly enough, it is New Vegas, and I like it because I think it has the most interesting mainline story. It has the most unique uh, setting. And also, I love gambling. I sure do. And I love giving myself level 10 luck and just being able to get all the caps. It is my favorite. We're doing no damage. I'm running for my life now. Get into the vehicle. The vehicle of safety. Into the vehicle of safety. Yep. Yep, new strategy. This is the old school methodology I used to use all the time. Eventually, the problems I'm faced with will no longer exist until that date. I exist in a state of annoyance. There was an anti-material mag on the re shelf. I think there was, actually. I think you're right about that. I really wanted to use the, uh, the other rifle, though, is the sad thing. I need to sleep, too. I need to fix all of this. Let me just go through my inventory really quick and see what we can drop. Is there a trunk for my car, by the way? Do I have a trunk in my car? Or no, I feel like I don't. Maybe it's in the front of the car. No? I don't think I have a trunk in this car. I do have a glove box, though. But that's just... That's not going to have a lot of room for us. Are you live on Twitch? We're live on YouTube team. We are live properly on both YouTube shorts and on like the actual main YouTube. So if you're enjoying, you can subscribe and check out the main channel if you want. All right, just put the gas canister in here, I guess. We'll fill that up. That sucks that I can't use these. Uh, I don't have the magazine for it, apparently. So I'm just going to drop these. That's a big chunk of weight right there. And then the shotgun... I guess we'll get rid of the shotgun later on. Let me go get a uh, battery out of that, too. And I can replace the battery in there. And now I can see again during nighttime. I'm very happy about that. I need food, too. Oh, no. I did not think about this problem. A lot of problems to be dealt with today, team. Let's just sleep. Tomorrow is a new day where problems can be solved at a leisurely pace. Oh, is someone there? No one's there. We're fine. Oh, I look good, though. Damn. In the bright lights? Oh, yeah. Let's go show them what for. Oh, beta blockers. Big find. Needed that. What else do we get? Well, I get another friend coming over. Hello there, friend. We are not actually friends. How would this be pre-recorded? Uh... I am AI team. Beep boop bop beep. I'm going to speak in binary for the rest of the stream. One zero zero one 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 zero 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 one 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 zero zero. That was a really funny joke if you know binary, by the way. How long until he dies, bro? What? We don't die. Once I get some food in me, oh, it's over. Let me just hop. No, oh, hold on. Let me just, uh. Let me just. There we go. <laughs> Lull? It, question mark? There is no question mark there. It's just lull. Uh, a motor. Is this... Oh, you are kidding me. You can't tease me like this. Oh. You do it in such a way that makes me confused. Is dog meat in this mod? Technically, yes. I haven't found dog meat. But theoretically, yes. Where's my junk chip, by the way? I actually could use this as ammo. Okay. Reload. I am out. Don't do that. That's rude. Oh. <laughs> it's so much fun to shoot this, I gotta be honest. Alright, well, we need to get in there somehow. I don't know if there's a way in or not. Oh. Don't do that. That was very close. I need food as well. I wrote an essay on binary. How'd that go? Thank you so much for the sub there, Bebo, by the way. I, I like that username. Is this the Bebo I'm thinking of? Or is this a different Bebo? I truly don't know. Maybe there's a way in from the upstairs. No, it's going to just be more windows into areas that I would love to take over, but can't. 
This is so evil. This is so diabolical that it does this to me. Ugh. Okay. I don't have time for staircases. If I have to... Oh, wait! Crops! Maybe they're good to eat. Are they harvestable? No, they're not. What a tragic day for those who enjoy crops. Okay. Well, if I can't get any gear that I need... We will just get out of here, team. I'm sure vault Tech has all the stuff that I need anyways to liberate the... I don't know where you came from. You just actually materialized. We're using a stealth boy as well. That's kind of impressive, honestly. What are the protection stats on the power armor? Uh, I actually do not know. I think it's pretty high, though. We are getting pretty encumbered and tired, though. Oh my gosh. We are nearly 100% on everything with this armor. Yeah, we are, we are safe and sound, team. We are all good. I'm just going to get out of here at this point. I'm going to get in my car. Oh, don't sit on the ground. Let's just super speed walk. Let's get into our car and see if we can drive out of here. And let's get on our way to vault Tech because we have a lot of fuel. We're chilling. Have you entered or seen any vaults? We're actually on our way to a vault right now. Did they clear this out for me? Almost. If I can move those two barricades... We're chilling. All I have to do is move the barricades. Oh, I am getting hot. Oh, dear. So one thing I didn't think over... Ow. That was rude. One thing I didn't think over with this uh, power armor team... Is uh, there's no AC in it. So uh, we're growing pretty, pretty hot. Just by sitting around in the Kentucky sun. Um, but never to fear. There's always a plan. I fear. We'll just go back to using the tried and true methodology. We've seen it be effective before. Let me turn on the AC for him too. There we go. Get nice and cool. There we go. Perfect. Oh, they're pouring in because they love me. They truly do. I don't want to have to do this. I it just it sucks that I have to. Yep. Okay. This is truly, you know what? Hold on. I wonder if the strategy works with this car. It kind of does, but it's a little bit of a Oh my gosh. For those wondering if this is good for the car, it is not. It is not. Zombie respawns are enabled, by the way. Is this a shorts live? There is a shorts live, but this is a vertical stream, if you're curious. So if you're on YouTube shorts and you want to watch the full stream, go to my channel, subscribe, and then you can find the full actual widescreen thing. There we go. There we go. I need food as well. Real bad. We are getting to the point where starvation may happen. Can I fight these guys now, or are we... Oh, hold on. We're good. We're good. Well, maybe not. We're gaining temperature pretty quickly, and there's more pouring in. The short blunt skill can't... Wait, you're kidding me. No! Eric! Not like this, Tim. Eric made a critical mistake, and uh, I did not realize that that animation could drag me like that. Oh dear. That's okay. I think, based on how the settlement is, I thought the power armor would be really cool. It is cool, but it does make me very hot. What a time to tune in. How are you, Mark? Welcome in. Today, we will be attempting it one more time. Hello? What was that? Was that a little friend? Is there a ghoul outside? I don't know if there's Nuka Cola. Thank you. Um, we'll attempt one more time. But 
considering the state of our settlement last time, we're not going to bother with them this time. We're just going to go free the civilians trapped inside the vaults. Surely they too can't be just all ghouls. If I get in there, clear out the neighboring area, and then get rid of the ghouls, I'm sure we're going to be fine. So I'm hoping nothing goes wrong. Yes, Beaver was getting very hot. You don't need the armor to be hot, temperature-wise, of course. Damn. I see what you did there. Anyways, let's get out there, team. We have a lot of things to do and not much time to do it. After I turn off the television and turn off the lights, save the Earth, team, please. The planet won't be here forever. Thank you very much for the sub there. I appreciate that. You are my new favorite subscriber on YouTube. Did you know that? Congratulations. Quite an honor. This guy is dead in your name. A clean kill. True to Kaiser. <laughs> God damn it. You sound like Husker from Hasbin Hotel, who's... I've never watched Hasbin Hotel. I actually don't even know if I know what Hasbin Hotel is. I don't think I know what Hasbin Hotel is. If I'm being honest here, the armor wasn't really worth it. Yeah, the armor was not worth it, sadly. I was not prepared. Oh, thank you very much for the new sub as well. You are now my new favorite sub. The person who was previously my new favorite sub, they are my old favorite sub. They are not my new favorite sub. Oh my gosh, wow. Thank you so much again for the sub. You are my new favorite sub. <laughs> I've learned the uh, the entire Zomboid through your shorts and videos, and to finally see you live is awesome. Let's go, George. I appreciate that. I appreciate that, man. I'm glad you enjoy it. Are you live on Twitch too? We're only live on YouTube, but we normally go live on Twitch Monday through Thursday at 9.30 p.m. Eastern. So if you like what you see on the YouTube streams... I would love to see you on Twitch. The username is Big Bad Beaver. Monday through Thursday. Tomorrow's gonna be Variety Day, so Mondays we always do whatever I want. So it's not gonna be Zomboids, but Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday is always Zomboids. We're currently doing a 100% Sprinters run on Twitch that has survived for over a week at this point. We're about 10 days into our playthrough, I believe, which is really cool. Trying to see how long we can go with 100% Sprint. No, don't do that. That was mean. But yes, team, the one thing I will also say, if you're enjoying, you can help me a lot by hitting the like button. And if you're new, like so many have done tonight, please subscribe. It helps me out a ton. Ever play Armor 3? I have. I don't know how you get away with that, by the way. That's insane. I would never get away with that. I would never, ever, ever get away with that. You don't get away with it either. Thank you. Z Nation, I've seen... Um, in terms of games, I saw someone ask about XCOM. I love XCOM. I played through, uh, the, the recreate, it was like a, the 20 something, like the 2010s early XCOM, where they rebooted the series. I really enjoyed that. I actually played it on my iPhone, if you can believe it. They had an iPhone version of that, or an iPad version, which is really fun. Um, I want to try the XCOM Chimera Squad at some point. I have not tried XCOM 2 at all, though. Oddly enough, XCOM 2, I just didn't do. Didn't expect to see you live on YouTube. Welcome in. Know any good any uh, good mods for Armor 3? I actually don't know any good mods. I really haven't put too much time into Armor 3. I've only played it when other friends are on and they want me to do Armor 3. Thank you so much as well. Sub, I'm going to have to, like, fix the sound effect because it's... Pl I don't know if it's, like, deafening for you guys, but it is very loud for me. Um, we are not getting any good gear either, which is sad. Is that a Vault 12 suit? Indeed it is, Vault 12. I don't know if that is lore accurate to be in Kentucky, but we are technically from Vault 12. Indeed, Luna, how's it going? Welcome into the YouTube stream. That's a hammer, which means I can finally do carpentry. Thank the Lord above, we love carpentry team. It is, as a beaver, it's one of my favorite activities. Um, shovel, sure. Actually, that's about to break, never mind. Do we not get crowbar? I don't get crowbar. Today is a horrible day. As a crowbar main, I feel very upset. Thank you for the key to this building. A lot of the Zomboids have keys, though. Or, excuse me, ghouls. The ghouls have keys. Thanks to the beta blockers. I will need that. The medex, I wish it was full. I'm annoyed that it's not. Drink some water real quick. We'll get that going. 
What do you like and dislike about this mod so far? Um, the power armor is really cool, but it's not very practical, sadly. Uh, it makes you extremely hot. Unless you're in the wintertime, playing is, like, not possible with power armor. But I do love uh, the vault suit. I think it looks beautiful. I love the Pip-Boy and the way it acts as a watch. The GPS add-on thing is a really cool addition. The ghoul mod, I'm gonna be honest, you really can't tell the difference. I wish there was a little bit more of a difference graphically between the zomboids and the ghouls, but that's okay. Look at this guy. Hello there, Jorgs. How are you doing today? I recommend XCOM 2. Chimera Squad is good too, but it has a lot of new mechanics. Interesting. I did see with Chimera Squad, they had like this breaching mechanic, which I thought was really cool. I think that's why I want to try... Sugar bombs? <gasps> Part of a balanced breakfast. Ooh, that is... Okay. That's just like a full box. Damn. Build 42 when? I have no idea, team, sadly. I wish I did know, but alas, I have no information to share with you on Build 42. I should sleep with procrastination. Team, if you have to go to bed, I completely understand. While I would love to see you stick around and watch the stream live, slumber time is necessary, team. Okay? And if you must slumber... Slumber, you shall. Dance magazine, I will read that. Oh, that's breakdance too. Oh my god, that's massive. Wow, with this jazz song too, it's kind of crazy. Chug the hot sauce. I don't think we can even eat. We're full to bursting, aren't we? Oh, we're actually, we could eat. Ever played Halo? Played through Halo 2 and 3 with a friend. And then I played Halo 3 multiplayer and Halo Infinite multiplayer for a while. I think Halo 3 is really fun. I'm not the biggest... Damn, you nearly got me with that one. That's tragic. That's tough. Um, I'm not the biggest Halo fan. If anything, I'd, I'm much more of a classic Call of Duty guy. Like, if you gave me either Halo 3 or Black Ops... Yeah, I'm taking Black Ops. I'm taking Black Ops 2. I'm taking Black Ops. I'm taking Modern Warfare 3. Like, okay, maybe I'll take Halo 3 over Modern Warfare 3, but like... I'm more of a Call of Duty. I don't hate uh, Halo, but just not my thing. I actually love shooting games, though. I do really enjoy shooting games, team. Let me go ahead and get on out of here. Is there a vehicle we could steal? Ooh, that vehicle looks nice. Is there a key for it? No, there is not. Actually, there is. Never mind. Never say never, team. There is no fuel for the vehicle, though. Maybe one of these friends will have fuel for me. Let me check the condition of this car, too. Apex Legends? Not a big Apex person, Woodchuck. Not the biggest... A Thank you very much for the sub there. You are my new favorite sub there, Hugh. I appreciate that. Um, I'm not the biggest... Apex person. I I liked it in the early seasons, but they just... They got into the trend of adding too much. It's just too much now. I don't know what's going on. There's like crafting, and there's like... You get shield by shooting people. I don't know. It's very odd. I play a little too much. 20 KLMs. Oh, man. Yeah, I was a Fortnite guy. I, as sad as it's to say, I was a Fortnite guy. That's why some people... You, you, I, I, we have not had it all happen tonight, thankfully, because we're not on Twitch, but... People like to suggest that because I play as a werewolf character in one video game, that makes me a furry, which is not happening. That doesn't make sense at all. If you do not know, Stalker is in no way represented by its name. Uh, it's a lot like Fallout. I've seen... Wait, I'm not in the driver's seat. Oh, I can't... E oh, that's right, because it's a police car. Okay, who's growling, by the way? Because that... Yeah, that shit needs to... That needs to stop. That needs to stop. On the ground. Thank you. Name of the game? This is Project Zomboid Woeful. It's a zombie survival game filled with noobish little creatures. Known as Zomboids. There they are. Standing menacingly. Standing at the concessions. Plotting their oppression. I'm taking them out. Definitely a furry. Okay. Thank you. And Beaver killed Ninja in Fortnite. That's true. That was the peak of my Fortnite. All right. I was I was like gonna gas myself up real quick about killing 
a streamer in a video game, but that's fine. Thanks for the nightstick, actually. That's useful. Is your bulletproof vest good, or is that destroyed? Actually, wait a minute. That's actually good for us. For once, a bulletproof vest that is not about to break. Incredible. That's incredible. What do you think of mods that uh, let you retain progression like skills, diary, notebook, and stuff? Uh, I have no problem with them. I think in multiplayer, I think it's completely fair to play with. Uh, the only issue I have... Hmm. The Baja goes crazy, by the way. The only issue I have is for the mods where you can survive a bite. That's where you lose me. Part of the fun I have with this game... Oh my god, Eric. Wait, you're cooking. Wait, Eric. Eric, who gave you a Michelin star? Jesus Christ, Eric. What are these powerful hits you're doing? I've never seen anything quite like this before. That is incredible. What mod are you using right now? A full list is, is available by, uh, by checking the description, I think. If you go to the full stream, at least. Is there fuel to siphon out of the truck? No, unfortunately, I checked. Well, maybe I'll double check, because I don't think I checked it properly. Let me go to the fence, too. Here, come on, little guys. I know you love vaulting over the fence and then falling over to the ground. Yep. Thank you. Okay, don't do... I asked you to not... I hate that attack. It's just so obnoxious. I'm not on my aim game today, by the way. I'm just not... I'm not with it. Really not with my A game today. And this is about to break? No way you get invincibility frames. What the hell? What is the name of this game? This is Project Zomboid, if you're curious, team. A zombie survival game filled with dubious creatures known as Zomboids. Will you play Fallout? We're actually... We have to go back to New Vegas at some point. I did a Fallout New Vegas playthrough last year. And we didn't finish it. And I want to finish it. So at some point soon, we will have to. But what I was saying earlier, I don't like cure mods. If, if there's a mod that lets you survive a cure, you kind of lose me with that. I don't like the idea of being able to survive bites. I think a lot of the fun I have in this game comes from the constant panic that like any fight with a zomboid could be my last. And one, one bite ends it all. You can be months into a run, years into a run, and then one little zomboid comes out, bites you, and it's like, well... You're done. Like, you should have paid attention. What if they're farm raccoon? What is this playthrough about? We are doing a Fallout run. Now, oh, hold on. Let me let me yank out my antenna so I can show you the GPS and get everything working, team, and show you the map. There we go. Okay. So, we were originally uh, going... We were starting in Rosewood. We're getting some gear from the fire department. We're going to go to the police station get some more gear. The plan originally was go to the settlement and check on them, grab some gear from there, and then go to the vault. But the last time we played... Uh, our settlement kind of fell apart, and now all of the uh, citizens of my lovely settlement have been transformed into the ghoulish creatures we see roaming Rosewood at the same time. So I'm not going to bother with the settlement. We're just going to go straight to the vault and save the people trapped inside the vault. I want to get into the vault tonight. We are not stopping the stream until I get into the vault tonight. That is my guarantee to you, and I cannot wait to fucking dominate. And succeed in my goal. All right. If you're enjoying the stream, by the way, like hit that like button, bro. All right. Hit that hit that like button. All right. Let's get some subs in here. All right. Let's get some shares. <laughs> Sorry, I'm turning into a, a big time a, the the generic big time YouTuber. Yeah, bro. Come on. Let's let's go. By the way, guys, we're sponsored by G Fuel. All right. If you're not aware, ten percent off with my code. Beaver at checkout with G Fuel. <laughs> oh my gosh. Weren't you the guy who put out the short about standing a few steps back from the fence? Yes. This is a classic case of do as I say and not as I do. Because I am a fool. Number 162 on the likes. Big W. Thank you for that, Snake. I appreciate that. Raid Shadow Legends team, don't make fun of Raid Shadow Legends, the only mobile game with console level graphics where you can play with hundreds upon hundreds of legendary class heroes like Giovanni, the ghoulish uh, Greece goddess. Play now for free on iOS and Android devices. Come on. Don't you dare question my allegiance. Let's slumber, by the way. We're a little sleepy. Wake up late at night. 
I don't even care. We're going over to the police station team. Nighttime. We're out there. What up there, Lola? How's it going? Does the Pip Boy have lights? I wish it does. It doesn't. That is one L of this of the Pip Boy mod, I have to say. Wish it had uh lights. Oh my god, it is red. Why is it so red? Had to leave for a second. What do you think about amputation mods? That is like the only exception, but honestly for me, if I'm at the point where I have to amputate my hand, I'd rather just restart. That's just my opinion on it. I'd rather just restart than have to amputate my character and like not be able to do half the things anymore. Radiation? No, it's just the sun setting upon this beautiful land team. We never stop to think about the beauty of the world around us, do we? Ah, oh, hello there, friend. For a moment, can we believe in peace? Come. Come. Stand on the- thank you. Look around you. What do you see? A beautiful na uh, what was a beautiful nation once can be reborn through friendship. Extending my hand out. Please. Don't you want to be friends? Oh, that's the groan of enemies. Yep, she was not pleased. She did not want to be friends. Oh no, there's more of them. Oh my god, wait, I'm a champion. You know what? Inside the building with you all? Oh, that guy has a gun too. That's big. Come on in. Thank you. I'll be taking that. I'll be taking that. Ooh, is there someone inside? There is. I don't have a flashlight either. Let's start clearing them out one by one. Board management is going to be pretty important. We're going to lose our baseball bat in a moment, but that's fine. That's not a big deal. This is looking bad, Beaver. Oh, no. We've been in way worse pickles. Believe me. This is like a minor level problem. This is not an issue at all. Believe in yourself and you will succeed, team. All right? Please open the door. Thank you. I know opening doors can be difficult. It's a challenge. You have to extend your hand out. Pull the handle. Yank it towards you. That That's calories. That's that, You have to exert yourself. I get it. All right? I've been there. I mean, listen. Look at me. I, I'm not the strongest man out there, but I need you to step up, Eric. Okay? I care about you. I care about you, Eric. Yo, by the way, thank you so much, Mac, for the $5 super chat. That's very, very kind about you. Um, I par uh, parry the struggle of the amputation mods with the they new mod. Is that the one with the vaccine? What game is this? Project Zomboid Team. It is a zombie survival game filled with dubious little creatures known as Zomboids. Can I ask you guys a very serious question, by the way? I'm generally curious, because I, I'm going to be honest, I've actually really enjoyed my time streaming on YouTube tonight. Do you guys want more of the YouTube streams? Car butchering in a nutshell? I don't think I need that right now, but thank you. New, they new mod is the mod where there's a single cure on some random zombie somewhere. I don't hate it, but still not a huge fan. Can these guys stop? I just came here to like... Actually, wait. Come inside. I need the key to this place. You can come inside. I just realized I need to like stop and like focus. Thank you. We get no key. Oh dear. Maybe I should not have... Oh, maybe there's people over here. Key? No key. Oh dear. Oh dear. Key? How is there no key? There we go. I was about to say, like, there has to be a key. There's no way there's not a key. What is this guy's special stats? Oh, he went big into strength, let me tell you that. Thank you, Mac, again for the $5 super chat. That's very, very kind of you. Grapes that are stale? That's a win for me. We all say yes. I appreciate that, team. We will look in at doing more YouTube streams. That's something you guys would like. Um, I rarely stream on Twitch, but like, I've enjoyed the experience of doing YouTube. It's different from Twitch for sure, but it's still a lot of fun. I enjoy the shorts and videos, but I wouldn't mind the lives. That's okay. 
Yeah, I mean, if, listen, if you guys aren't into the live streams, too, if you, like, want more just edited stuff rather than, like, raw, I completely understand that, too. Don't worry. Are we really not going to get... Well, you know, didn't really get what I wanted here. Um, that sucks a little bit. I don't even get shotgun ammo? Really? Wow. Okay. This was not a great armory for us then. I like the live. Thank you, Woeful. We don't even have a flashlight yet, though. Damn. Let's check for armor. Purple sticker? I can put that on my thing. Another GPS. Hmm. Did you guys see a flashlight? Because I did not. Did you continue where you were saying about Stalker? I have not played Stalker. I've seen Stalker. I'm not opposed to doing Stalker at some point soon. I guess it's just more a matter of like finding the right time for that. Is there only one locker room in here, by the way? Is there a second one? There is a second one. Okay, where's the, where's the light in here? Thank you. Oh, here we go. I want to try and get NCR stuff again, but... A Spiffo sticker? No way. I'm putting the sticker on. That's going to look gorgeous. I cannot wait. Here, turn that on. I want to see how it looks. Where do I... Oh, I see how it works. It just customizes the, the border of it. Okay. That's kind of cool. Well... I guess we'll just uh, wait a little bit. Maybe we sleep in here and then we can check for... Actually, we'll just check for vehicles now. There's no reason not to. Simulator ge uh, games week when? What type of simulator games you want? Are there mutants in the mod pack? Sadly, no. Sadly, no special variant mutants like super mutants or anything like that. It's just all ghouls. Ghoulish fiends. Oh, dear. Oh dear, come on. I just need a car and then we're out of here. Like, we're in there. We are in there. Does this have fuel? No, it does not. Are there cars over here? Ooh, there are. How'd the ghouls become feral so quick? The radiation team. Let me tell you, random. What is your favorite mod? Asking before I go to bed? Uh, I would say my favorite... If I had to pick, it's kind of split. I always change my answer. It kind of depends on the state of the day. But like for me right now, more traits is pretty essential. I don't think there's a there's very few runs I do without more traits because it just adds so many new traits to the game that I think are really essential to like just any sort of setup. That might be an unpopular opinion, but I really do like it. I really, really do like it. Injured is goaded. It's not bad. Asking a personal question. Do you earn a living off of these content uh, create, uh, videos and streams? Uh, I mean, don't get me wrong. Uh, your support helps, but it, it's not enough for me to like full-time do it. I have a job, if that's what you're asking. You guys are very kind, of course. I don't... I, I'm not trying to put any pressure, of course, on you guys. I appreciate you all just hanging out in the stream, nonetheless. What's the longest you survived? Five months, five days, team. I'm gonna sleep now. In the car. Why not? Oh, I need water. I'm also gonna need to get more fuel. We'll go to the gasoline station, fill it up, and we'll head out. Because sadly, it doesn't seem like we're going to get any sort of good stuff here. Actually, I might need a... You know what? Here, take that mug really quick. I'm going to fill that up with water. Donate life savings. Now. There it is. No. Uh, when are you going to play uh, Nothing, the Steam game? Isn't that game literally nothing, though? Hello there, Rad Boy, by the way. How are you doing? Welcome in. Just want to double check I didn't miss anything in here. Actually, there was a bandage. That's good. I wish I could use the Medex. That kind of sucks. I really wish I could. Dance magazine equip. Read. I love dancing. What, what dance was that again? Was it the twist? It was the shim sham. 
I don't like the Shim Sham that much. You could always play something. What do you do for work aside from Twitch and YouTube? Do you guys really want to know? I work for a startup company called Rhythm. You may have heard of it. It is the Discord bot. When did you get into Zomboid? I think it was 2021 that I got into Zomboid for the first time. Mm, yes, 2020. Yes, start of 2021. Damn, I avoided all of those ghouls, by the way. That's incredible. No baby trees. That's huge. Off-roading champion here. I'm pulling up. Great. No, don't siphon the gasoline! What are you doing, Eric? I can't believe it, Eric. Holy shit. I've never seen a bigger throw in my life. Oh, wait, but you can recuperate. You can recover. I believe. I believe. Holy shit. Does it lag for you when you drive? No, I have a pretty good computer. Oh, dear. Oh, no. How excited are you for the new Fallout 4 update coming out on the 25th? Um, I think it's cool they're doing it. I am not the biggest Fallout 4 person. I don't even... I think I played it on PC at all. Um, I don't actually own a next-gen console either, so like I can't. It's cool that it's happening for those who are ex like have Fallout 4 and they want to play it again. I think it's really cool. Maybe at some point I'll have to give Fallout 4 a fair shot, though. I don't know. We're so close to being done filling up the car. Please don't do that. I don't know why. If you're bitten, I swear. Oh, that's to your hand. Just a laceration. You're fine. Clearly, you're okay. That is so... I asked you to move, and you didn't want to move. That is so tragic. I asked you to move. I was pressing D. The move wasn't coming. The move was not there. The capybara, by the way. Thanks so much for the $2 super chat. That's very kind of you. Do you like capybaras? Can I be honest? Capybaras, they kind of steal the limelight from the beaver. Because capybaras are the largest rodent on Earth, which makes beavers the second largest rodent on Earth. Kind of crazy. But thank you again for the $2 super chat. I did not even finish filling up this car. We are nowhere near being done filling up this car. It's a laceration. It's fine. A la as long as it's not a bite, we're fine. Please, when I ask you to move this time, in fact, I'm just preempting the move. Thank you. We're doing more damage with a stomp, which is sad. Oh no, brother! Oh. Always sad to see a fellow vault survivor. Thank you very much for the sub there, by the way. Aiden, wow, we shared the same exact name. Isn't that crazy? Have you ever played Timberborn? I have, and it's very cute. I like the idea of building a city with my little beavers, and they take over. What are your computer specs? I have a Ryzen 9 5950X, RTX 3070, uh, and then I also have 64 gigabytes of RAM on Windows 10 with like a bunch of terabytes of SSD space. So, this computer should be good. Uh, but if I'm gonna get technical now, if I'm gonna talk about Project Zomboid for a second, unfortunately, even with a tank of a computer, I do run into issues with lag and frame rate issues, uh, specifically when playing on like really high population settings, which is like fair, there's a lot of Zomboids, but like in Louisville at times, it drops to like 20. 30 frames a second and frankly in my opinion a game that looks like this I don't think it should really be lagging that much that is my one crit the one of two crit one of three criticisms I have of Project Zomboid number one it lags too much the optimization is not great number two the net code could be way better as someone who's worked on a multiplayer mod for Project Zomboid and like dealt with multiple servers being set up it's not a fun time uh and it could be way better and way improved 
And third issue, and this is going to be the most controversial opinion. I don't really like the music in Prodigy Zomboid. I don't know if you guys have noticed, I have the music completely turned off. Because I just do not like the music in Prodigy Zomboid. I'm not a fan of the music. I'm sorry, Willful. I know that's going to upset people. I don't like it. Have you played DayZ? I have. I like it. In my opinion on Day, I did a whole YouTube short on DayZ, by the way. If you're curious, I'm like my full thoughts. Long story short, I think it's fun. If you're more focused on PvE, I think Zomboid's a way better game. But if you want pure PvP, I think DayZ is better. I think Project Zomboid's PvP could be way improved. I think DayZ does a better job of like that tense fighting player versus player stuff. I think it's way better than DayZ. Uh, but outside of PvP, I think Zomboid does everything else better. State of Decay, we're going to be playing soon. Actually, do you guys want me to chill? I can chill really quick. I haven't... This is a world premiere, by the way. Hold on. This is a world premiere. <laughs> I guess we can call it that. Um, I have not announced this just yet. It was going to be announced tomorrow, I believe. Let me uh, fix this, by the way. Team, we are doing something called Zombie Week. It is going to be a full week of streaming where each day I get on stream, we're doing a different zombie game. We're going to be doing Humanity, we're going to be doing DayZ, State of Decay 2, and Seven Days to Die. It's going to be starting May 6th at 9.30 p.m. Eastern on my Twitch channel. I'm going to be streaming on Twitch for all of this. So if you guys are excited, if that sounds fun to you, I would love to see you guys over there on May 6th. Each day is going to be a different zombie survival game. So Humanity, DayZ, State of Decay 2, and Seven Days to Die. Humanity and DayZ have already played before. Uh, State of Decay and Seven Days to Die, I really have no experience with. So, kind of like a mixture between stuff I've tried and stuff I haven't. We'll see. No Left 4 Dead 2. It's zombie survival game specifically. I love Left 4 Dead 2, but we're not doing that during zombie week. But yes, team. You're, you're seeing it first. You're seeing it first on this YouTube stream. How exciting. And if you're watching the VOD of this YouTube stream, then it probably already passed, sadly. But that's okay. Let me get back to the game. Hold on. Have you played Days Gone or Last of Us 2? I have played neither of those because I don't have a PS, uh, a PlayStation. I know Days Gone is on PC. Uh, I just haven't bought it on PC. Oxygen not included. We're not going to be doing that. Is that even a zombie survival game? I don't think that is a zombie survival game. How did you get your world to look so overgrown? It's a mod called 10 Years Later Team. And it works really well with the apocalyptic vibe we're going with. He killed the Overseer. Well, listen, he was trying to tell me I couldn't have Baja Blast. My chem's addiction. My chem's addiction is more important than the Overseer's life, okay? I'm just gonna say it. Why are we only on YouTube, Beaver? We are only on YouTube just for a little fun one-off stream. But how are you doing, Coin? Welcome in. Is 10 years later hard to set up? No, it's very easy. It's just like any other mod. You just click one button in your mod manager and you're done. You would have to start a new playthrough, though. You can't put it on an existing playthrough. But that's it. Have I played Minecraft? Yes, I loved Minecraft as a kid. I don't really play it anymore, to be honest. I've I've kind of gotten burnt out on Minecraft, to be honest. I, I'm just not... There's only so many times I can load in and build a wooden hut and... Get iron to make an iron pickaxe to make to get diamonds to then make a diamond pickaxe then make a elder ender portal and then go to the nether and get the things to go make the orbs that go to the ender. You know what I'm talking about, right? You know what I'm talking about. I just got burnt out on Minecraft. There's just it's the same. I it's a gray game. It's just, I do the same exact thing every time. It's kind of like insanity, you know? <laughs> Have I ever told you the definition of insanity? I need to take a look at my map. So for that reason, I don't really play Minecraft anymore. But a very, very rarely I will 
jump back in on my Minecraft arc. Um, actually, I need to turn around and keep going because I need to take the third turn instead. We're fine. Yo, by the way, Alan, thanks so much for the $5 super chat. That's very, very kind of you, man. Have you ever done a nomad run? We might be doing a nomad run if I break down my car. Um, I've not really done a nomad run before, like in any serious capacity. I would love to do a nomad run though soon. There was talks about doing like an RV interior run and like our home is only our RV. And if that breaks down, like we're just stranded, like we have to always stay around our RV. Um, so that might be one of our next playthroughs we do. But I haven't done a Nomad Run serious just yet. But thank you so much, man. I appreciate that. Thank you so much for the, the super chat. That's very, very kind of you. You don't have to do the same thing every time. Yeah, I know, but... Dopamine and serotonin is just not produced anymore when I play a Minecraft team. I played that game when it was like in beta like i remember i remember playing the super old version of minecraft that you could play on your browser how many of you remember that do you guys remember the browser version of minecraft because that game was honestly kind of lit it was actually pretty cool that's my turn off by the way hold on i gotta take that turn rv runs are lots of fun i'm gonna be doing one i think next that's gonna be our next run what is your favorite Thank you again, Alan, for the $5 super chat. The alerts are a little bit delayed, but that's fine. Um, so I can't look at chat and do things. Apparently. It's just, if, if I look, if I look over there to read your messages, it's just going, there's just going to be something that appears in front of me to destroy my vehicle. There's just going to be something that spawns in front of me. I could look for a split second. There would be a giant roadblock. Oh, I hit my DPI button too. So now my mouse is weird. Thank you. What a joyous day. What a lovely day, in fact. Don't chat and drive. Okay, I will not be looking at any messages for the remainder of our drive to the Vault Tech location team. I am fully dedicated to getting into the vault and saving the inhabitants within. If we can rescue their lives, I will be so pleased. I will be so happy. That's not even on you at this point. Like, I'm, I don't know what's happening to me. Do not ever give me cars. Do not ever hand me your car keys. I will crash your vehicle within five seconds. You will not be able to drive anymore. I hope you have all state. Because, dear God. Is that, wait, 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 is that my turn? I don't even know anymore. Drake, by the way, thanks so much for the $2 super chat for car insurance money. Thank you. I appreciate that. That'll that'll really help with my premiums. Um, oh, actually, I'm supposed to take this turn. What a windy little road. Oh, I love Spacebar. That's how I break. Have you played Party Zomboid on a controller? It's really fun. I have... Didn't really go too well for me. I know there's actually a really big amount of people that love doing Pretty Zomboid Controller. I can't personally because it's just too much. It's a lot to, to manage, personally. Quit the Mentats? Bro, I can't quit the Mentats. What are you talking about? What a nice little leisure... Wait, am I dying? Oh, we're fine. Never mind. We're okay. Oh, I, I actually am dying. Actually, I am dying a little bit, technically. Can we get in the car? Thank you. Can we start the engine? That's breaking. Thank you. Let's let's get rid of these little guys, yeah? I'm I'm injured. Let's replace that, yeah? Can I go around? Hopefully there's no trees. Thank you. Just gonna drive around real quick. I can't believe the car still runs, by the way. That's actually the most incredible thing about this whole run. Gotta lay off the jet. Team, this is the only cam I use, okay? The Baja Blast, please. And now I'm out of Baja Blast. 
So if you guys were worried about car crashes before, yeah, it's going to be even worse. Sorry for the fam. No worries. Have you seen the movies Wreck or The Fear? I've seen Wreck when I was a kid. That game, that, that movie was pretty scary to me because I was like six or whatever. But um, I have seen Wreck. I've not seen the other one you're talking about, though. Are we there? Wait a minute. This seems like the place. Maybe? Is this the place? Show me the money. No, this is part of the... I don't know what that is. Well, maybe, in, maybe I investigate that really quick. Maybe there's water. We do need hydration, team. That's so vital for us right now. We're hungry. We're thirsty. Of course it's locked. Why wouldn't it be locked? How did you find out about Proudy Zomboid? Um, good question. I originally found out about the game through a streamer that I used to watch on Twitch. I think he no longer streams. I it was He was a very... He wasn't like a very well-known streamer, but I, I just followed him for a little bit. There was one night he did where he played Zomboid, and I remember... The first time I saw this game, I was like, damn, this looks stupid as hell. Like, I can't believe you're wasting your time playing. It's just The Sims, but with zombies added. Like, how can you find this fun? And I clicked off, like, within a minute because I thought the game was stupid looking. But then in the back of my mind, I was constantly like, what, what was that game he was playing? Like, I just had to keep looking at it. I had to learn more. And eventually I was at the point where I was like, okay, I need to just find out what this was. I went on YouTube, and I searched up Freddy Zomboid, and I found Ambiguous Amphibian, and I saw his Zero to Hero playthrough with Jonathan McSmithian, and I swear, within the first two episodes, I went from thinking, this game is so stupid, how can anybody play this game, to, I need to buy the game now, and I need to try it for myself. Within two episodes. And that entire series was like, what, 15 episodes or something like that? It was a lot. How is there no weapons at all in here, by the way? That's crazy. So that is that is how um, I got into Zomboids. Yeah, we're not looking good on the, uh, the weapon situation, by the way. I do have a Nuka-Cola, though, that I haven't opened up. I guess we can drink that. There we go. Oh, well, no, can't really use any of that. Damn, dude, there's no loot in here. Garden hell, maybe that'll work, I don't know. Why is our weight so bad, too? Oh, because we have a gas canister on us. Okay, that explains a lot, actually. Here, fill up my mug. Let's go back to the car, and let's just put things away. Are there giant roaches in this mod? No, sadly. What Fallout chem is Mountain Dew? Probably Psycho, if I had to guess. Let me put this away. Oh, we are in minor pain still. I don't know what could have caused that. Surely I've done nothing wrong. Anyways, back on our way, team. We have a nightstick. That'll have to do. I really just want to see the vault. I want to see what the vault's like. Oh, please don't crash. Going a little going a little quick down this windy road. Uh, that is very spooky to me. Very, very, very spooky. Have you tried Last of a Zombies, Beaver? Well, you know what? That was actually a blessing in disguise, the way this car shut down right before crashing into that. Because I would have floored it directly into them, and there would have been no recovery there. But I have not tried Last of Us Zombies. Uh, I did a playthrough that was Last of Us inspired, with like spore buildings and things like that, which was really fun. We did that on Twitch. But I have not tried the special variants, because when I saw it on the workshop, it doesn't actually visually change the Zomboids. It's just like, it puts a little text above their head that's like, oh, this is the clicker, and it's like... Well, I... I, well, I don't, I don't, that kind of killed it for me. I think this is the turn. Please tell me this is the turn. Please tell me we made it to vault Tech. <gasps> we did! We made it to vault Tech team. I'm so happy. Finally, after so much work. I'm new to Project Zomboid. Can you help me out? Um, if you're brand new to Project Zomboid, I would recommend you check out my tutorial. It's a, like one of the most popular YouTube shorts I've posted. You can very easily find it. But 
If you have a more specific question, I can do my best to answer it in chat if you drop it. Oh, this is not going to work out. That's not going to work out. We need food. Hold on. We need to fix up our... I can't believe we injured ourselves, by the way. I cannot believe we injured ourselves. Oh. Is there anything in here? Oh, I can't see a thing when it does that, by the way. Is there a way to get in there? Actually, I might have just lost them completely. That's big for us. Actually, wait, what am I doing? Rely on the garden hoe. Come on. Oh, there we go. That's the damage output we needed. That is what we needed right there. The range. Look at that. That's effective right there. Let's fall back. Of course, there's two more that were just waiting. They were hanging out. Why wouldn't they be? Completely okay with me. There's a random little crate in there. I don't know what's in there, but we'll carry that out later on. Okay. All right. Okay. All righty. Uh, we have beta blockers, right? Somewhere, correct? Yes, we do. Here. Take those. Perfect. Yeah, I don't wanna... I don't wanna get taken out here, team. We just made it to the vault. They're relying upon me. Surrounded by ghouls. The inhabitants need me. We are doing no damage, though. It's just... Oh. Thank you. Playing with this mod and seeing the actual damage output numbers is like, holy shit, we are weak. That injury destroyed our hand. Like, oh my gosh. There we go. That guy does have a gun, but how much ammo does it have, truly? That's the big issue. There we go. Lumberjack shirt. Okay. Actually, the rover does have ammo. And that is a full condition shotgun. Not going to be great for the weight, but we will take it. I don't think I need the GPS at this point, to be honest. Um, I might drop that. Might just get rid of that. Don't get up. Prioritize your movement. What mod's this? It's a collection of mods. If you check the description, it should have the link. There we go. To be fair to the ghouls, you were killing everyone in the vault -Tec grounds. Well, they're the ghouls, though. They're ghouls. I think I'm allowed to do this. Propane torch. Food. Nourishment. Where is the stuff I need? Oh, no. Not in the trees. Please. No more trees, zomboids. Oh, this is about to break. I can feel it. Yeah, not looking great. We need more water, too. I could use the car as a weapon again. Not out of the question. Oh, big hit. Loved that. Don't know why we're doing eight damage. Is it really because of the endurance loss? Really? Okay, well, I mean, we are at 17 capacity, actually. That, that explains a little bit. Probably don't need two shotguns on us, actually. That, that would be a big help. We'll come back for those. There we- yeah. That was a big help. That was a big problem. The pit boy looks great. I don't want to get up. I don't want to take it off. Okay. I would like the shotgun. I don't need the other shotgun unless it has- it does have ammo. Okay, we can get rid of this now. Have a good day. And we have shotgun ammo for the other shotgun. I will rest in the car. Maybe there's a snack, too. Maybe there's a little treat in the glove box. Who knows? There is not a treat in the glove box, but that's okay. Let me just wait in the car. We'll wait. We'll rest. All right. We're in as best a shape as we will possibly be in. I'm dropping the GPS. At this point, we're here. We have what we need. That is useless to us. Um, hello? I can't see through that, and that is very annoying. I just brought over a good amount of them. Cool. I just want water. What do I want? Water. When do I want it? 
as soon as possible. Preferably now, if you have it. Maybe they have water for me. Maybe the Zomboids will have water. Maybe they will drop a delicious bottle of water that'll be very refreshing and provide me with the dopamine that I seek. My mental is slowly being drained. I need the water. I need there to not be these guys. Don't do that. Oh, no. Please. Please. Thank you. Nice. Okay. Great. Any of you have water? That's fine. I don't actually need water. I'm an endurant creature. I can live for days upon days without hydration. It's not necessary for me. I was just joking when I said I want water. Rems Kentucky was killer. Thank you. I'm glad you liked it, man. Thank you for playing it. Can I get in there now? Oh, no, it's locked. That's right. Maybe we get a move on. You know what? Maybe we, we just leave. That's a farm. Let's go and go to the vault. Let's just go to the vault. <gasps> Burgers! Wait! Oh, my, I'm in there. Oh, there, there's a line forming for the burgers, though. Oh, my God. Okay. Excuse me. Excuse me. A lot of people. Oh, we hurt ourselves. I've hurt myself today. That's to my right hand. Of course, it has to be to the right hand. It has to. I can't vault over that. That's fine. Thought I could. Clearly, I was mistaken. That's okay. I'm right there at the vault. I'm I'm right there. I just have to get across. I have to go across this bridge, I think. I think. Sheet of paper is garbage. Take beta blockers. Bottle cap is garbage. I know it's valuable in the lore. It's just it wait. Hot sauce eat. That's food. Hot sauce is food, actually. Hot sauce is food. They can vault. Okay, there is a double standard going on, and I don't like it. Can you guys vault? Okay, they can't vault over this. Very interesting. I just want to get to the vault. I think it's that little... Yup, there it is. Oh my god! Out of my way. In fact, I'm gonna need this. Something tells me I'm gonna need this. I will do as I must. Let me- I have to hope this door is open. No! It's not open! The vault is right there. What? Oh my god, they're phasing through it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Loop them a little bit. Loop them. I, I, you know what, team? I hate to be this guy. I don't think we're getting into the vault. I don't think we're getting into the vault. I don't think it's going to happen. And I don't think we can... Yeah, okay, you know what? We've just planted ourselves on a peninsula. A peninsula of sadness. Oh, dear. No aiming level. It's jammed. Is that what I'm witnessing right now? We're jammed? Load around, my brother in Christ. Unjam the shotgun. Insert the shells that are required to fire the gun. Oh, no. This is... It's really bad. It couldn't be... <gasps> He's doing the work for us, though! That one man is a hero. That one man is a hero. If we can just convince him to chop it down for us, we're good. If that one man will do the work for us, we're fine. I will loop myself around and around until we have no other option. I will loop around this entire peninsula if I have to. Oh, I don't have a clean bandage. Okay, that is tough. That is tough. Eric might be going on a bit of a suicide mission here. Oh, no. I shouldn't even waste ammo. Is he still wor- Oh, no. The quantity of Zomboids placed was higher than anticipated. That is tough. 
Well, I don't want to leave you guys on a cliffhanger. So what I'm going to do really quickly is I'm just going to go... We're going to cheat. We're going to use uh, cheat codes. And we're going to witness what the inside of the vault would have looked like. I want to know. I need to know. Our man is gone. And I feel somewhat... Wait, did I not even put... it? Wait. Did it do it properly or did not... I did do it properly. Thank you so much for the subs, by the way, team. I really appreciate it. If you are subbing, you are my new favorite sub. You are helping out a ton. That was an untenable situation. But alas, it's fine. I'll just quickly load up the final backup world we have. And we will see what's inside. I think our biggest issue was honestly just like not having food and water. That's honestly on me. Like, I just couldn't find food and water for our boy. And I feel bad. Need to go. No worries. Enjoy the rest of your night. You look cozy in that robe. I am pretty cozy right now. It is cozy hours, team. We stay warm. We stay happy. Curiosity qu uh, killed the dweller. There are people inside of there that need our help. Okay. We are utilizing cheat codes, team. The beaver does not care. I have reached critical levels of not caring. Oh, okay. Well, I need to turn on the GPS first. Off to the vault we go. Hello there, friends. Don't mind me. So this vault little lever doesn't do anything. This is a lie to you all. This is simply there to ruin your day. This is locked, but thankfully I do have a passcode to enter. Very good. All right. Hello there, friends. Don't mind me. Just going to venture on down to the lovely vaults. Enter the elevator. Oh, my God. Wait a second. Hello? <gasps> no way! Hold on. Wait, wait, wait. I'm actually going to turn off the cheats for this. I want to see what this is like. I'm going to give myself a crowbar. Wait, that's sick. We're in the vaults. This doesn't seem like a really... I don't know. That seems weird. I can't get in there, unfortunately. I guess all this is locked up. There's so much gear over there, though. Wait, so I would need a sledgehammer at all to get through there. Okay, well, thankfully, I came equipped with a sledgehammer. Even if I did manage to do it, it would have been not worth it. Because I, I don't have the sledge I need... Nuka Cola though, damn. Oh, the little Vault Boy guy, damn. That looks good too. He is cheating, team. I've been very transparent about the cheats. Yep, we are cheating. No one's coming for this one, team. No one's coming to shut me down this time. Look at that little ham radar. That's pretty cool though. I like it. I like the orange couches. Damn, the furniture here is kind of lit. Have you played Half Life? Yes, I played all of Half Life. Two, and all the episodes as well. I've played through all of Half-Life 2. Okay, is this like the reactor room? That's pretty cool. Is there anything of value in here though? Ooh. Oh, but this just leads us back over to here. Here's a little kitchen. That's pretty nice. Is there... Oh, here we go. Look at that. Nice and well stocked. What was that? Blanco mac and cheese. Let's go. Oh, no no graphic, though. That's tough. The vault tech fridge full of Nuka-Cola. That is pretty cool, actually. I do like this a lot. I'm glad that I did activate cheats, because if we went through all that and we dealt with all those outsiders and then we had the, you know, then we found out we need a sledge, like, oh boy. What the hell? There's weapons hiding behind there? Laser pistol? M60. Okay. Well, hold on. We'll take the laser pistol for sure. Oh, that looks nice. We got to try it, too. We got we to gotta try it, right? We got to try it. Does this need a magazine, though? It does require... Okay, energy cell. Hmm. 
Hmm. I'm a little confused. This has, it has zero count? I don't know how that works, to be honest. Depleting energy. Here we go. Here. Okay. I think I understand maybe how it works. Not really. I don't know. Uh, Jap, by the way, thanks for follow. I appreciate that. Welcome in. Or the sub. It's YouTube. I can't get this pistol to fire. And I am in debug mode, which is a problem. What about the laser rifle? What about the sniper? Let's try that. What type of ammo does this need exactly? It needs a DK7S magazine. Ooh, that does look nice though. Oh, hold on. Maybe this is the energy cell magazine? Maybe not though. I'm not sure. Can't wait to see the new map expansion. It will be cool. I think Build 42 will be very cool for sure. Hmm. Oh well. I can't get these guns to fire. That sucks. Is that it to this vault though? Is it just kind of like the hangout area and then... What's in here? A bathroom? Okay. I love the details in the vault. I think the gra- like graphically this looks really cool. I just kind of wish there was more. I thought this was going to be more expansive, to be completely honest. And there's not even zomboids inside. There's no ghouls. There's nothing. There's just little guys. There is just little me and myself my and my. I don't know. Okay. Well. Hey, you know what? We, we technically made it to the vault. And if I were playing single player, this actually would be a really cool pre-existing base location. Like, can you imagine? You would be perfectly safe from zomboids in there. You would be perfectly safe from zomboids. Not a single person could hurt you. But when then you come back up and you're like, oh dear. Oh no. No, I'm not a snack. Why is this locked? Oh god. You've trapped me inside with the beasts. Urgh. Hurry. Okay. Woo! Yep, you thought. You you thought, buddy. There. Can I vault over this? Oh, I could. Oh, but they can't... Oh, no. Okay. Well, that was an experiment. That was an experiment, team. That was an experiment. Obviously, that was an experiment. Oh, well. <laughs> oh, well. Oh. Uh. God damn it. Team. Yeah, unfortunately, Eric is dead. He made it to his vault. He made it to his vault. One way or another. He, he checked on his settlement. They might be dead. That's okay. What is the name of this game and where can I get it? This is Project Zomboid Team. It is a zombie survival game. It's on Steam. It's $20. On Steam. It is very, very cool. It is very, very fun. The mod list that we were using... For anybody curious, is in my Discord as well. It should also be in the description of the YouTube stream. So if you guys are on YouTube and you want to try out the Fallout mods yourself, you can. Um, but I want to say really quick, big thank you and big shout out to you, Shark, for suggesting this cool little thing. Again, it's all on Steam. If you're curious on trying it yourself, all of these mods are linked right there. One button, click subscribe. You have them all. Um, and maybe you can figure out how to make the guns work. I was not able to. The power armor was really cool. I loved the NCR armor. I wish we ran into more of this stuff. I wish we could try out the chems. I wish we could try out more of the stuff. But maybe we'll have to do another stream. Maybe we do a follow-up video. And I show it off how it works. Oh, hello there, Shark. You are here. Hello there. Big shout-out to Shark. Big shout-out to you, Shark. Here. W, Shark. Thank you, Shark. 
saw Fallout 3 in New Vegas on the same Steam thing. I think it's just Fallout in general. I don't think it's like meant to be one specific Fallout game. You could fine tune it, of course, if you if you want to make it cer uh, like specific to a, a certain Fallout game. You could totally do that, but yeah, team. It is all good. Please do more YouTube stuff. This is the plan, team. I, I the plan is um, we'll do more YouTube streams in the future. Um, hopefully like one or two a month. And if you guys want more regular streams, we do go live every Monday through Thursday on Twitch. I would love to see you guys tune in over there. If you're curious, the link is in uh, the description of the channel, but it's the same exact username as well. You can find it right there on Twitch. Same exact username, same exact logo. Just got back from work. It was so stressful. I'm going to have to watch the VOD. How did your runs go? I loved it, Shark. Oh my gosh. Thanks so much for the sub. You're my new favorite sub. I appreciate that. I really had fun with it, Shark. It was really, really fun. A um, couple weird bugs we ran into. And I think my difficulty settings I was were I, I actually went with way harder settings than I probably should have to show off this mod. I actually cranked the zombie pop pretty high up. And um, I made food and water really fucking rare. And I think that's what kind of got our character killed in most areas. But I just didn't play it as well as I should have. I didn't play it as well as I should have. When is the next update for Project Zomboid? We have no idea, team. Sadly, we do not know. But no, I had fun with it, Shark. I think it was cool. Thank you for suggesting it. Thank you for doing that. Thank you as well, Sean, for the sub on YouTube. Might have to watch more. Of course, we have YouTube videos coming out. We have uh, other shorts. We, we I mainly post shorts, but we do have some videos coming out, uh, both with Project Zomboid content and like other stuff, so... If you guys enjoyed, definitely hit the sub button. It helps out a ton. Appreciate all the super chats tonight. You guys are incredible. Thank you so much for all the, the support there. And I hope you guys enjoyed. This was a very fun mod to check out. Very, very fun mod collection to give a chance. But thank you, everybody. I'm going to dip on out of here. If you guys enjoyed, subscribe, like the stream. I'll see you guys next time. But hopefully tomorrow on Twitch if you're curious. Monday to Thursday, 9, 30 Eastern. Have a good night, everybody. Enjoy yourselves.